Okay, and I think we are live. Hello, everyone. Happy Sunday. Do you hear me? Do you see me? Am I coming through? Matt, you there? Hey, folks. Hi, I'm Spike. That's Matt. We're going to play some fucking vintage story. Let's not drag this out. Let's get right into it. Let me yeah, get let this me thing going. On. Oh, sure thing. Uh, let me get into the single player world here. Let me head to our 84 hours, damn near 85 hours in world of Homestead Itis and get going. I've been thinking obsessively all fucking week about this goddamn game. <laughs> hey, everybody. Oh, hey, Sakari. Hey, Britt. Thank you for coming. Oh, God. I always say, oh, this is going to be a boring one, but I don't know. This one might be boring. It might not. I just know that I was terrified last week when I turned that corner and I saw that goddamn bear, like a fucking mosquito fart from getting into oh, the yeah. chicken yeah, coop. Yeah, like that's, the, that's a great thing about the bears, though, like a surprise boss fight. Yeah, but they it almost got into the chicken coop, and that was hours and hours of effort that almost got absolutely rat-fucked to oblivion by one mm -hmm. dumb mistake. So so we will be fixing the fucking chicken coop. That's high on the so priority list today. fixing the chip chicken coop or yeah. making a barn? Barn. Making a barn is basically what I'm ah, I'm going cool, to make cool, cool. a barn. I'm going to make two barns, one for the pigs and one for the chickens. Because okay. I, I don't like how the other animals look at them. Like, wolves got close to the pigs. A bear almost got in with the chickens. And at one point, I'm just going to fucking run out of luck. I know that now. Mm -hmm. So that's got to be fixed. Hello, Britt. <laughs> Hello, Sakari. I was looking forward to you streaming today. The perfect background to finish this blanket I'm working on. Oh, I'm glad to hear that. Hmm. Let's see. What's going on, Vintage Story? You're still trying to log in, it looks still like. Still trying to get in. Oh. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. I just saw something. Hold on. Let me get out of here. Whoops, the cl yeah, yeah, you did crash. You did crash. Are you I'm in the wrong I, Yeah, I'm in the wrong fucking game. Sorry, folks. Let's try that again. You know, while you're at it, while you're fucking around in your directories, uh -huh. make a copy of the safe game. I will, I will. Okay, cuz I'm suddenly terrified. Let's I, see. I think I think it would be a good idea to copy the safe game. Just saying. This is the one we want. Okay, let's try this again. The game is already running. I guarantee it's not, bro. Uh, but you know there's some little memorized program. Yeah, let's try it again. The game is already running. Give, okay. it a, give it a chance to get it shit together before you start killing processes. I'm going to start killing processes. Uh, Come on, dude. We ain't got time mm. for this. There you are. What are you even doing? Get out of here. There we are. Okay, let's try that again. This is still better than the microphone hassles. That oh, absolutely. Okay. Right? Let's try it again. Um, yeah, we are on the 1.17, one, 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 1. 1. excuse me, mm -hmm. single player thing. Let's try it now. Homestead Itis, do not fail me again. So this is interesting, though. You, we just found out that you can't open this save game in 1.18, didn't we? Yeah, and I don't that, like that's that. That's what just happened there. I don't like yeah, that Yeah, I was very hoping much. that we could, could move this one to 1.18. Yeah have the hassle of having to make fucking nails every time we make a chest yeah. um but okay. uh let's see like, this is uh, where it's stuck before it's stuck in 17 it's, land. Oh, it's it's doing something it's doing something now okay and we're in let me go ahead and open the LAN, and you can come in any old time excellent okay now let me just kind of re-figure out what was going on okay it's two in the morning low rift activity that's good Chickens should be reproducing like crazy. That's also good. Let me head up here. Sound is coming through. That's good. Okay, there's a couple of broody hens. Okay, and I am out in the berry patch. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, uh, we were absolutely going fucking berry crazy the last couple hours of the last time we played because all the berry bushes, as predicted, ripened at exactly the same time. And we had to basically go in and take care of them all because... They have an incredibly, incredibly low period where they won't be rotting just like that. And we want to have fruit for the winter. So if I'm not mistaken, we still have some berry. Yeah. Oh, my God. We have so fucking much. Okay. So that's I'm still gathering currant. more, by the way. Red currant and cranberry. Holy crap. Okay. So we have some red currant juice. And that's black currant. Crap. We have so much. Okay. Uh, all right. I think red current is, this is what we're going to have to do here. Okay. Like, we just, <laughs> wow, so much, so much juice, so much juice. It's all going to be wine. <laughs> it's all going to eventually be wine. I just know it. 
Okay, and you are... Okay, good. You're good to go. Fruit Press, we need you. Be a champion. There we go. I've got more berries. Oh my god, of course you do. I'm putting them downstairs. Okay, and I'm going... And these... What are these? Are these... Yeah, they're oaks. Okay. So I can't just, like, haphazardly destroy them, because I... And that's right! That's right! The barley! I have to take the barley out of the... I have to take the barley out of the, the greenhouse because it's too warm in there for barley right now. As a matter of fact, this will probably be better checked at noon. You Well, remember, you can take the barley out or you could turn it into not a greenhouse anymore. That is true. Just essentially, just open the window. That is I true. I break the window. Um, hmm. There we go. Okay. So uh, the berries have overflown down yeah, there. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I, I figured... Oh god, um, it's kind of insane. It's kind of insane. All the juice that processing is kind of insane. Okay, so... Alright, and so this can now take a few more liters of red currant juice. Yeah, for folks who are not aware, for the folks who are currently watching, this is probably going to be another one of those... <laughs> another one of those streams where we just, like, are frantically working to make sure things don't just, like, rot out from under us. Yeah. Um, I feel like you... Oh, I shit. I'm take up firewood. Okay, yeah, I feel like yeah. you are set here, though. Um, uh -huh. So I am going to go and head out to where I was looking for iron. The search for iron continues, right? Yep. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, again, if you missed it, wow, last time around was very, very productive. This is extremely ugly. I, I acknowledge that, I'm aware of that, and I plan to fix that, hopefully tonight. But we got the hell hammer working. We got the corn working. This is all automated. This all just runs by itself. It's pretty fucking great. And oh, wow, look at that. Yeah, it has some lime in here because we went on a big old lime run. I think I'll get that now. And uh, we are making more leather because I want to make us some armor, to be perfectly frank. Now, let's go ahead and get this downstairs. You know, while we're here, just put this lime in the in the thing here oh look at that i have one rotten liter of something you know what? let's just throw that in here too because who cares and let me get this juice downstairs i need to actually build we have so much juice i need to actually make more barrels i think like that's how crazy it's getting because okay so that's 50 liters that's the most it can deal with see it's completely full the barrel's completely full and you know what? I'm going to seal that too. So I now have cranberry, cranberry. I have two, I have 100 liters of cranberry juice turning into wine. I have 50 liters of red currant, uh, 50 liters of red currant juice turning into wine, black currant juice. And I'm going to actually repurpose this barrel because this barrel was normally holding honey, but quite frankly, it's going to be of more use <laughs> making more juice. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know, I'm not even going to move it. I'm just going to leave it there. Let's see what the berry situation here is like. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. And you said it was overflowing. Huh? Oh, my God. You weren't even kidding. Holy crap. Yeah, yeah. I had to put it in the next vessel. Okay, so basically, we're just going to have to go ham on the cranberries right now. Mm -hmm. And just make some more cranberry juice. I knew this was coming. I truly did. I truly yeah, did. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I did not plant all those. I did not go around grabbing every fucking berry bush that I found during those early days with the expectation that we would be leading a berryless lifestyle. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully this will be enough to see us through the winter. I think it will be. I think so. I like to think so. It's just, and this is all... Oh, release the screw. Whoops. There we go. And now we so have all of this now and then, dry mash. I find the... Uh, every now and then I find a block of obsidian. Like, you know, in, in, in amongst other rocks and stuff. Uh -huh. And I feel like they seem to be rare enough that I feel like they might be important or useful for some purpose, but I have no idea what they could be used for. Do you know of any any purpose for those? Obs a block of obsidian is just Full as useful blocks, as... blocks, I mean. Yeah, crunch, it's just, it's like every other kind of obsidian thing. It's not a big deal. Uh, okay. Now, where is the... I had that one. Oh, right. I put it. I left it inside. Let me go get that one liter of rot that I found in my inventory. Well, this is squeezing itself out. Okay, so. I put it in with the leather because I was in a rush. 
Oh, and I, if I'm not mistaken, I was leaving a whole lot of mash to rot around here so we could just... Yep, there it is. Yeah, 4% spoiled, so on. You know what? Get in my inventory. You'll spoil faster. There we go. That's such a weird thing. Oh, I figure, you know, carrying it close to you and your body heat yeah. and whatnot. Yeah, it, it makes sense. It's just like the behavior that it encourages is weird. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, uh, Brit A says feeding mash to animals are for compost. I... I am mostly composting it because it's just, it rots so fast. It's so great that way. Let's see. Okay. And also a thing I wanted to do tonight, I want to finish up the berry stuff like I'm doing right now, but I would also very much, oh crap. Okay, here we go. I would also very much like to get going on barns for the animals. This is something I was discussing with Matt before we went live because that bear terrified me. And I don't want it destroying literal hours and hours and hours of progress just because it manages to glitch in with the chickens, which it very nearly almost did very recently. And uh, yeah, that's not happening again. I refuse to permit that to happen again. Okay. Ooh, pigs. Pigs? Well, we got pigs here, pigs so don't pigs. feel the need to uh, preserve them. And it, for folks who don't remember, our look at that. Yeah, our pear tree. We have a pear tree here. It, it grew. I'm very happy about that. And how are the pigs doing? Okay, the pigs are fine. I believe the pigs do not need food right now. I think they're all, like, ready to mate in their current state. Let's see. I don't want to get too close. Okay, boar. Ow. Oh, what happened? Pigs do not take kindly to being harvested. Okay, so we have a sow ready to mate, a sow that's pregnant, and two good weight boars. So yeah, things are going just fine in there. Let's go ahead and just protect them again. And the chickens I know are, are fine. They've been fine. What concerns me now is, yeah, these berries. Let's get this other thing of cranberry juice downstairs. I was actually looking at mods the other day and I very nearly installed some, but then I like wandered off because attention span of a gnat and one of the ones that very nearly got me for vintage story recently was where i could dry berries in the oven and i could like bake them into into breads and stuff that Those one are seemed, good ideas yeah it, yeah it seems very reasonable there is a lot of sort of weird decisions that are made in vintage story when it comes to the cooking like i'm not sure why they do certain things the way they do and yeah, having like Three different kinds of nutrition in one food item is overpowered. Apparently. Yeah, that's that just seems a little weird because people do that all the time. It's called having a meal. <laughs> but for some reason, it's like unacceptable in Vintage Story to have like raisin bread or something like that. It, it, mm -hmm. it just seems a little weird. Some weird choices are made sometimes. Okay. And I kind of want to correct that. But at the same time, I don't think it would be the most scintillating content to sit there and watch me bake muffins, even no matter how bad I want to do it. I don't I don't think that um, it's wrong or at, at, or it would make the game any less interesting to have more different kinds of things. you. Could yeah. Cook. And it, and it would, it would stop. Oh, That's George no Harris, thank you so much for subscribing. You get to watch me make cranberry juice all night. <laughs> Not all night. Uh -huh. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. But uh, yeah, this is okay, and this is all black currant juice. Okay, so that's that. I I managed to. Oh God, that's insane. Oh my God. Okay. Oh, all right. Let's get some more cranberry juice made. I think this can hold twenty more liters. Yeah, it can. Wow, we're going to have so much cranberry wine. Yeah, Brit A is talking about how the animals in Vintage Story do need light. If they are not exposed to daylight, they will despawn, which I think is incredibly obnoxious. Oh, interesting. Yeah, yeah it is, apparently this has been tested and confirmed by people who super care about this kind of thing. And uh, you can't have underground animal farms, for example, because if you try that, the minute you leave the chunk, there's a decent chance yeah. they will just disappear. Well, that sounds like a fairly legitimate balance concern, because I like underground is probably... Uh... I, th I think there are a lot of ways that living underground primarily would be handy. Yeah, but I also think it's not necessarily it. about balance. I think it. you and I have both seen what happens when these stupid animals get stuck in caves. They can just, yep, like, chill true. out there forever. 
So <laughs> it might be less about balance and more about, okay, the stupid fucking animals preventing all the other animals from spawning by sitting here at the bottom of this Ooh. cave. And no one's oh, ever going to see it. Yeah, so let's just go and take care of it. My God, they're flowering. They're still, they're going to make more berries. It's, it's absolute insanity. So many berries. Oh my God. Okay. How are we doing? Good. All right. I'm going to go ahead and take that then. Just endless burying, endless berry, berry mashing, berry juicing. Okay. Okay. So I've picked up more pork on this hematite expedition uh, than nice. hematite. Definitely um, bring that I home. I will make stew. Yeah. I just, uh, I can't get to the place where I want to check. Look at all this mash. Holy crap. Mm. I may give some to the pigs just to get it out of my inventory, man. Wow. Absolutely absurd. So are, are any of you spoiling it? Are any of you? Okay, yes. There are some that are actively spoiling. That's great. Okay. And here we go. Wait, do I even have room for this before I do this? I don't remember. Let me check. I could always move another... I could always move another barrel down here, but I just want to make sure. Okay. All right. Yeah, I have room for one more, one more squeezing of cranberry juice. No scurvy for you guys. Yes, exactly, Jeremy. <laughs> for a change, we're going to go through winter well nourished for a change. Mm -hmm. Okay. We won't fuck up this time. Not this time. Speaking of no, fuck I don't think things went that bad. No, we, but there was... We were never really starving. No, no. God, look at all... Yeah, we have to get rid of this rye. We did find ourselves thinking, wow, all these pies are going to last us through the whole winter. <laughs> yeah, We've got so like many idiots. pies. Yeah. And that was not really how things were. Okay, so let's just but get... But still, uh, we did not start. Put away. Pretty sure. Yeah, okay. Now, this is kind of the last one that can go in the current berry juice bucket. And then I better eat some something because I'm definitely... I could use some nourishment here. Okay. And all right. And that's 50. And what is my nutrition looking like? Okay. My fruit nutrition's looking great. So vegetables and protein is what I need. And that probably means that's what you need too. Um, can't make anything with that. I guess we could just cook a buttload of raw bush meat. There are worse meals. Barely. Oh, hey, look mm. at that. Never mind. There is food here. Huh. Didn't know that. Where's that bowl? Don't know what this is. What is it? Oh, red meat with parsnip. Exactly what I needed, actually. Perfect. Me too. There you go. I have a bowl of it right here. Oh, never mind. You know what? No, actually not. Never mind. Come here, you. No need for you to be taking up space in there. Uh, speaking of taking up space, another thing I definitely want to get around to taking ah. care of it. Uh-oh, that didn't sound good. Uh, I just broke my pick one block away from the block I wanted to sample. Uh, yeah. So I'm coming home. I did not expect to have to, like, drill through mountains in order to get to the right place to uh, prospect. But yeah. That's, that's where we are. There we go. Anyway, I got pork on me, so it's not a wasted trip. Good. And what do we got here? Okay, so are you? Yeah, you're 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 ready to go. Okay. Wow, I have so much mash just in my inventory, just chilling, doing nothing, taking up space. Can't wait for some of it to go bad. I may give some of it to the pigs <laughs> just to get it out of my inventory. Um. Okay. Is like. I mean, I guess you're. Are you just not currently looking for pregnant pigs? Is that why you're not bothering to feed them? Um. Yeah, basically, I, all right, basically what is going on right now is the pigs do not need to be fed right now because they are pregnant already. And ah. I do not want any pigs that will not be generation two to get pregnant oh, again okay. and eat my food, you know? Okay. Yeah, yeah. So I, I'm trying to save <laughs> all my effort for the next generation and ignore the current one. Oh, God. Okay, so everything's looking good over there. All right. Now. Actually, okay, well, I'm coming home with some pork there's uh, yeah that. you can throw that in the in the in the larder in the basement yeah my big focus right now is what already is this? right okay so you can grow pea crops and k crops everybody can grow pea crops and k crops 
Oh my god, and I have to, oh, I have to harvest all of this. Look at all this. And I don't have, like, any room to do any of that. I think Lucy is officially sick of uh, being in the room with me Aww. while I'm talking. Lucy is our um, dog. I'm gonna don't know much about this game. How cold does it get in winter? Can you freeze stuff outside to preserve it reliably? Believe it well, or not, no, I idea. do not. It's like, it's one of the weird things about Vintage Story. We can definitely freeze to death. But mm -hmm, I don't think okay. leaving stuff outside in the cold will actually preserve it, which is kind of a ripoff now that you bring it up. <laughs> it's kind of a fucking ripoff, but I think that's how it works. I'm going to just try and do a little bit of organization here because this is pure nonsense. What's going on in my inventory right now? I, you know, I don't need to be carrying around birch logs. Like I don't even know what I'm doing with my life. Oh, we got so many pickaxes. This rules. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna. Lulu, you want out? Puppy. Okay. Okay, dog. Yeah. So, uh, we have a copper right. one by the door to the north, and then we have a bronze one. <clears throat> that's just kind of hanging here, not really doing much. Let's go ahead and put that sticky away. on the bedroom floor, and I do not like it. <laughs> Don't have time to find out what it is. Actually, you know what? This reminds me. Oh, I gotta go get get P and K crops. But yeah, how many uh, pickaxes do you have on you right now? One. Okay. But it's so, full. Okay, great, cool. We we did you see the copper one by the door? Because we have a copper one by the door. Was a copper one I could be using? I should use the copper one. Yeah, instead. if this you go to the door that me. heads out through the north, there's one that should be yep. hanging there. I will go grab it. Okay, let's. Yeah, I, I saw two on the wall, and they were both bronze. P and K. But, uh, so. Carrots. I carrots seem to be doing okay in this. One, one, two, three, four, five carrots. This is the perfect job for copper. And what are carrots? Uh, so heat resistance until 32. It is 20, but in there it'll be 25. Okay, cool. Pardon me. Carrots it is, no problem. Let's just get these planted. Oh. God, it's noon already. Yeah, I know, right? I started doing this at like 4 a.m. <laughs> yeah, I've been picking berries all day. Tell me about it. Yeah. Uh, it's a good thing. Well, I say it's a good thing that you don't need sleep in this game, but I kind of wish you did. Um, Oof, I'll have to come in here and do harvesting. That's the person who's been installing like survival mods in uh, Skyrim. Oh. Which also are too gentle, by the way. Yes. Yeah, you've been kind of going into a whole Skyrim thing recently, haven't you? You've been watching yeah, people play, like, and you decided, screw this, I'm going to play too. Yeah, just, well, like, one Let's Player talking about how, like, they ought to start playing it again. Got uh -huh. me thinking of, yeah, shit, yeah, like, there are all kinds... Because, like, back when I was playing, like, there, when I first played Skyrim, the mod scene was only just getting going for it. Right. So now it's basically a whole new... I never I don't think I ever bought any DLC for it, even. Whoa. So, like, I... My my Skyrim experience is not is not where Skyrim is these days. Oh yeah, same. So yeah, that's how I figured, you know, there, there's a lot of stuff that I could and you know, it's one of those games that you're never really fully done with. No, not really. Not, I'm not if you're normal, I guess. A ludicrous amount of stuff to do in it. Yeah. Um so I figured I'd, I'd check that out again and um, you know, do it very modded this time. So I've been putting in all kinds of like quality of life and realism and prettiness type mods. Um, but it's it's hard to fully avoid mods which just make things really easy for you. Like, yeah. there's a lot of just overpowered stuff. Oh, hey, huh? I just found zinc ore. Oh, nice. Grab well, that's that. That's interesting. Seriously, um, I, I, think, not... I think we need that huh. to make brass, too. So Yeah, 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 we do. That's interesting. We yeah, so I installed some mod that, like, I don't even know which one it was, but one of the mods that I had installed was... Uh, changing my jump height to like seven feet in the in the air, and that, <laughs> if you hold down the button, you would just hang for uh -huh. an instant and then descend very slowly, like a like a balloon full of air. Sure, it's very weird. Um, I do not know what I, I don't even know what mod. I, like, I think it had to be a mistake, um, or you know, it just could be someone fucking around and just like no one can stop you. Upload your weird mod. One of the it was definitely one of the like race tweaks mods that like gave i i was kind of hoping that they would just kind of make like the the various uh like skyrim races more like even and give them interesting abilities or abilities that made more sense i think it just made them more powerful like yeah. all of them 
um, which is not at all what I'm looking for. Skyrim is not like a hard game that needs to be made more easy. <laughs> Fair enough. So, I don't know. Um, but uh, it, it was one of those mods, and it was definitely not the mod that was for the race that I was even using. Uh -huh. So it was something like overflowing its bounds, definitely. <laughs> I have more honey. That means more jam. There's another mod that adds like a uh, thief, as in like Thief the Dark Project, Thief the Metal Age style. Um, well, I just like steal anyway arrows whenever I stuff. play that game, so. Yeah, you know, but I love the trick arrows in Thief, and I thought it'd be cool to have those. Unfortunately, it also gives you a, like, just, you start off from character spawn with a spell that lets you instantly te teleport to the store where you get the <laughs> magic arrows and stuff. And, like, that, it's like, really? I love really? That's your idea of a balanced mod? I just, ah, oh, I'm not, I'm not into that. I want it to be harder, not easier. Twelve leather, just pulled that out of the uh, the barrels over here. So, weak tannin. See, this is what I get. I should I should have known better. I have to go get another barrel. Close, not the barrel. Um, this. This should be over here. So this is water, nothing, lime water. Okay, so. Let's just get this going. Right. The leather making process in this game, if you are not familiar, is kind of exhausting. Let's see. This is all gravel. We need oak logs. Let's see. Is it in here? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So basically, to make leather in this game, you have to soak hides in lime water, scrape them with a knife, then soak them in weak tannin, and then soak them in strong tannin. It's wildly inconvenient. <laughs> there we go. Let's get this strong. Sounds like vintage going. story. So, yeah, exactly. It's, ex it's, it's this. Welcome to vintage story. That's what this is. Okay. You're playing this game for convenience. That's for damn yeah. sure. So now I'm making strong tannin and weak tannin, and now we have some water. We have a little tiny bit of lime water over here, but we also have, if I'm not checking, yeah, we have a we have some lime over here. This is terrible. I know. I, I know it's terrible. This is. We will fix this. We will fix what, whatever the fuck is going on right now <laughs> with my interior decorating and, and architectural stuff. It's, it's, it's a nightmare. I know it's a nightmare. It's fine. No need to point it out. Okay. Uh, but yeah, now that the wind is blowing on the windmill, you can see what I managed to accomplish uh, last play session where I managed to get the windmill working. So let's go ahead and disengage the clutch here so that the corn isn't just pointlessly spinning. And get back out. I will fix all of this. I promise. <laughs> it's just, it's, it's as big an eyesore to me as it is to you folks. I promise. It's just, it's working and I'm thrilled that it's working. And that's all I need right mm -hmm. now. That's all I want from it. And this is 50. Okay. So now we have to get 50 lime. 50 crushed lime, I should say. Okay. Okay. And we take 50 liters of water. It's a one-to-one -one ratio. There we go. 50 lime into 50 water makes 50 liters of lime water. So now we can begin the leather making process with a few things. Uh, da, 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 da. So rawhide huge. No, I'm going to save the huge rawhides. Uh, oh, wow. We have a lot of huge rawhides. A lot. We have like, huh. Yeah. Okay. I'll use a few. Let's see how many it takes. Can you do one? Okay. Two, three, four. Can you do five? Cool. Six. Okay. You can do five. Okay. And we will seal that. Put these huge hides back. And just kind of let the process take its course. I will. Oh my god, are you seriously still cooking? How many are left? Four. Okay. There. Okay. And there we are. Bush meat takes so much effort to cook and it's so nutritionally not worth it, but it feels bad just letting it go to waste. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Now let's just... Whoop. There we go. Just let that cook down. 
and prepare to make some more honey. Let's see, two, four, six, eight. So I need 0 0.8, 0 0.8, and then eight berries. Do I have eight berries that I can take from the giant berry stash in the basement to make some more jam? Because for all my pretenses to making mass quantities of jam, I only have two pots of blueberry jam down here. So, oh, and for folks who missed it last time, this is where we are pickling carrots. I'm very excited for us. I want to hear Spike sing more. <laughs> oh God, no, you don't. No, you don't. Uh, my husband genuinely suffers because he, he listens to me sing. I am no. very tone deaf. I'm, ex I'm very sort of, what's a good way to put it? enthusiastic but not very talented is the best way i think we can i just it. don't like it when you sing in a lift oh while we are like in a taxi mm -hmm. and someone is forced to be in our presence <laughs> like, capitalism matt is I, embarrassed by his wrong. wife's terrible I, singing I, th I think that's not an okay thing oh I like i'm singing. sure they've had worse in their car yeah i mean it's not vomit it's just me singing exactly badly. there we go well, maybe one more. It's not like we're running low on it. Okay. So I will be able to have maybe one more pot. <laughs> one more pot of honey. I'm so excited. Although I kind of want to make a white currant pie. That would be fun. I might just do that. What's the flower situation looking like down here? Because I know I cranked up a whole bunch of... Yeah, I have a whole bunch of rye flour. Yeah. Let's see what we can do with that. Let's let's see. Why not just fucking completely dedicate myself to fucking cottage core bullshit for the entire stream? <laughs> Why not? Let's get this out of the way. You're not cooked yet? Holy shit, bro. Okay, finally they're cooked. Finally. Okay. All right. Uh come here 17 pieces of raw of barely edible meat. Come here there all right there are now 12 pieces of barely edible meat just chilling out in the larder when you come home i would happily eat them if i was there <laughs> you know how i love barely edible meat oh god it's your favorite okay i'm always a big fan of trash food all right okay that'll do it also make sure to like take up any mushrooms you find when you're out because we always have like some mushrooms but never enough of the same kind you know oh yeah that's that's a weird restriction on cooking right there okay so come here you yeah vintage story is nothing if not weird restrictions on cooking mm. okay so let's just take a liter here open you up One. which reminds me of like another thing i'm running into in skyrim um yeah. Do you remember there be like I'm actually unsure of whether or not this is from a mod. Do you remember Skyrim having like a whole bunch of just food recipes in it? Um like you get some horker meat real, and a pile of salt and like a random potato you found in a vampire's lair. I'm gonna be real, it's a been a long time since I played Skyrim. I I think time. it might be vanilla, but I don't I don't remember it. I guess because I was not playing with uh like a survival mod and I didn't have to eat to live. Maybe I just never interfaced with that. But I definitely don't remember that from before. Okay. God knows all the other crafting stuff in the game was enough. Mm -hmm. I had totally forgotten okay. that you could like mine iron to make your own swords and shit. Yeah. God. It is so hard getting enough honey for this. But I don't care. There we go. I'm going to have four servings of white currant honey soon. How exotic. Hey. Now let me just check on the animals again. Make sure no animals are around there. And last I checked. Okay, the carrots. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. All right. So, no, nope, still. Oh, hey, some of it's finally rotting down. Fantastic. Okay, anyone else? 97% spoiled. Awesome. Ooh, ultra high sphalerite. That's good. Actually, one of the things I wanted to mention is I want to make some brass because I want to make a brass torch holder oh, so we can we just can have definitely a, do that. Yeah, we can. <laughs> so we can just have brass, a brass torch holder because that means the torch in it will never burn out, and we can just you keep it by the fire pit. You know. Oh, that would be cool. That would be very cool. 
I think I am not going to find a whole lot of white iron White currant jam. Here. Doesn't that look appetizing, everybody? Okay, and that'll do it. Now, in the basement with you. We have now three, count them, three whole pots of jam put up in the larder. Very excited for us. And, oh, you haven't even been sealed. Oh, sorry about that. Here, you're sealed. Okay, so that's, we have so much wine in this goddamn basement. 34 liters of blackcurrant juice. So do we have, like, what's our blackcurrant situation? Kind of okay. Yeah, kind of okay. You know what? I think, anyway, I'm going to head up and see if I can't make that pie like I was talking about. Is there a bucket down here? No. But I think there was a bucket upstairs. <laughs> okay. And... Bucket? Oh, there you are. Hello, bucket. God, I love this indoor water source. It makes everything so much easier. Okay, now... Yeah. Bucket. Flower. Right. It took us way too long to get the uh, indoor water source. But another thing that I think that the home needs is a second fire. Yeah. Because this, uh, like, having to... Like, if Weird. we're finding ourselves um, melting... Um, melting down metals in the kitchen. And that's, that's not <laughs> ideal. True. Okay, so that's the last of the white current. Now let's just make another pie down here. Just to, just to have it. Just to make it. Let's see. Get rid of, yeah, some more white currants. Why not? Matter of fact, I think I'll bake four white current pies. Get completely rid of the white currants. Why not? There we go. And there we go. Let's just get a little bit more water and flour. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, actually, you know what? I think I only need that much, and then I'll be rid of white currants. There we are. So that's all the white currants taken care of. Nice. Although I should shouldn't waste the heat, I should just make yeah 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 okay, never mind. All right, awesome. I have twenty liters of literal putrescence on me. That's great. Let's go put the putrescence away. You get in. You get in. Anybody else? Anybody near? Uh, everything's fresh for a few hours. They're not gonna. Oh, that one's starting to spoil finally. Yeah, this will all get down to business, and then we'll have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 liters of rot. Holy crap, I'm definitely going to have to make another make another barrel for that. By the way, for folks who do not know, that will all rot down into compost. So that's why I'm doing that. Yeah, okay. Um... You're done. You're done. These are coming. That's coming. Okay. Uh, firewood. That's what I want. Let's put this up here and get some firewood because it's time to bake some pies. I'm fairly certain. Okay. Yeah, let's get another firewood. I think it takes six. That seems correct. Yeah. Now, torch. And as soon as those burned out, we can put the pies in. Hi, Dugabug. I never got into Skyrim because the vanilla game felt so unpolished and too open-ended. I have unrealistically high standards. You want to know what happened when Skyrim dropped? Like, to this day, mm -hmm. I remember Skyrim dropped on 11-11-11 because of the huge promo that was going on just globally and what they were releasing for it and going, you know, Skyrim drops 11, 11, 11, Skyrim is coming. And there were billboards and there were commercials. And I remember I have friends who are cartoonists, obviously, and we were doing a convention in, I think it was Phoenix, Arizona, 
we, I think we were doing Phoenix Comic Con and we were driving down the road to get to the convention center and we passed one of those billboards that just had, you know, buff Skyrim guy just scowling down at us from the billboard. And one of my friends was very much not a gamer type. And she saw that and she was like, I wonder what that is. Like, I see that. I, I, what is that? And I could feel like the nerdiness fucking welling up in me. Because keep in mind, this was back in the day when... Like Skyrim wasn't like a, a known thing. It wasn't a running joke. It wasn't a thing where kind of like even your grandma knows what Skyrim is now. It was a thing where it's like if you cared about when Skyrim dropped, you were a fucking nerd. And I, I, I just I could feel it just coming up at me like, oh, God, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. But no, I did it. And I was like, <laughs> Skyrim is this game where it turns out you have the soul of a dragon. And keep in mind, not everyone who makes comics is a fucking nerd. <laughs> so you're just like hearing I was just hearing myself say this to them like they don't fucking care what are you doing but I kept going because I was so excited for Skyrim it's like you're a dragon in it like you have the soul of a dragon and you have to like save the kingdom that are like they're kind of like Vikings but they're also kind of not and it's like you start out not knowing you have the soul of a dragon but it turns out the language of dragons I swear to god this is exactly what it's like the language of dragons is like you know magic and that's how they fly and like when when they when they breathe fire that's also a spell and when they fly that's really fun and i can't wait for it it's gonna be so fun and god bless my friends they, they sat there and they listened to me <laughs> like like any other person would be like bitch who asked but they're like oh cool <laughs> <laughs> and I was just like, oh, I know it's nerdy. I'm sorry, but I'm really excited for it. They've really been building it up. You know, this was back when people still gave a shit about E3 and they were debuting it. And like it was uh, people like screaming when Skyrim debuted at like these games and they would show mm -hmm. like the big sweeping scenes of you you kind of like bird's eye view flying over all the ruins and you know that song Dovahkiin Dovahkiin da 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 and everyone's like oh god this is gonna be the best game of my life and no shit absolutely true true story when Skyrim dropped I think I played it for 16 or 18 hours like yeah, that that's... much people will hear this and they will think this is an exaggeration no it's not it's really but not I, I have to tell them that, that it is not no I mean, you 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 ate. Yes. You peed. I did. I don't think you slept. <laughs> I think that really was just solid. Like I mean, you, you, that was you know you were not working a, a day job then. You didn't, yeah. yet, didn't yet have a comic book company. You just had comics you were making. Yes. So you had freedom to do that, and that is when you are excited about a game. That is what you do. Yes. Yes. You I, and break everyone... your life on it. And everyone like fucking dunks on, like, the Skyrim opening now. Like, it's a running joke. No, when that dropped, that shit was fire. People loved that opening oh, yeah, when no, it yeah, dropped. Yeah, that, like, don't let anybody tell you fucking different. Everyone loved it with a capital L. They thought that was the deepest and, by, shit By ever. opening, you mean, you mean, like, the, the riding on a wagon? Yeah, the, the so you are finally yeah. awake opening. Mm -hmm. Like, people dunk, dunk on that like fucking crazy. They're full of shit if they tell you now they didn't love it. <laughs> It was great. And I played that game. I played that game for 16 hours. I would not have eaten if my husband did not literally bring me food. And he played for a long time, too. So, like, don't let him tell you. He was just, like, a, a, a an observer. Don't let him tell yeah, you. No, he was no, no. Just we, we had two copies of that fucking game. Yeah. And we sat played on our computers that were right next to each other. Yep. And we sat there and we played it until we, like, literally couldn't play it anymore. And then we went to sleep and I dreamed about it. And then I woke up and played it some more. And Do you remember anything that you dreamed about it? Because that sounds fascinating. I just remember like sort of almost like I was floating through the woods. That's what it felt yeah, like. I, was I, I honestly woods. think that like the fact that I have dreams where I fly these days is largely because I played a lot of FPS games. Yeah. And there I was, was just... that same sort of just gliding effortlessly movements. I have baked several pies. It is helping me get rid of the horror that is our berry harvest. And I'm actually going to, I'm going to do some more stuff actually. What is my nutrition? Okay. Vegetable is in terrible shape. Vegetable and protein are in terrible shape. Going to have to take care of that. Can I leave you alone or are you going to, are you going to burn? I think you're going to burn if I leave you alone. I have to stand here and 
stare at it. Because if it burns, that'll be a huge waste of effort and resources. There we go. Blueberry pie is all done. Okay. So now, just so we're clear, Matt, in the basement, mm -hmm. we have... Da, 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 da. We have four blueberry pies and three white currant pies. So oh. you better eat that shit. I had better eat pies. Like there's some kind of risk to me <laughs> not eating pies. Yes. And I'm going to cook a little bit too. We definitely need to cook a bit. So I'm going to just grab some carrots. And I know we have a ton of meat over here. So let's just grab some meat too. Because, again, for folks who aren't familiar with this game, you'll see under the stats area, my nutrition. And I need vegetable nutrition and protein nutrition. Because that way, I'll get more hit points. Let's see. It's a good mechanic, but I never pay attention to it. Yeah. Just like real life. <laughs> there we go. All right. Now. So that will create six servings of red meat stew with boiled carrot. And we can just get going on that I think but first oop, put this away get some one two three four maybe five it's not like we're low on we have 132 firewood that's fine there we go and that'll cook we still have a little bit of boiled turnip over there right down here and I'll just have to figure out what to do with these blueberries before they go off right and everything is being kept down here. I, I make sure to tell because I'm, I always wonder if like someone is signing on to watch me play this for the first time. It's like, what the fuck is she doing? Um, things last longer if they are in a cellar. Foods just last longer down here. And uh, you can see what we have here. We actually have our blueberry jam and white currant jam on the lowest shelf. If you look at the tooltip at the top there. And they will stay good for over a year each because they are jam. Jam is the easiest way to preserve things black currant juice 34 liters you know what can i make any black currant juice i suppose i could make some let's see what we can do here this is black currant juice black currants right yeah okay so let's see if we can't just like get one okay so this has water in it let's just dump that yep come on Put it away. Okay. Or, all right, put it away. And let's just go ahead and squeeze as many of these blackberries as we can. How many can we do? Oh wow, we can do, look at that. Oh, we can do 23, good. So this will produce 7.19 liters of juice, that's fine. There we go. And always got to make sure you have a bucket underneath there to actually catch the juice. So you don't end up like an idiot like me. Letting all the juice fall on the ground when you squeeze things. Okay. Eat the last of that. Oh, that did good. See, my vegetable satiety is so low. I'm just going to have to make like vegetable mash at some point and eat that. How are we doing? You done? Okay. And we'll just put this away. I love Skyrim memes. Tomix the Tank Engine is Dragon Mod. <laughs> yeah, you know who yeah. I watch who does that a lot? Uh, there is a guy called Doug Doug who does a lot of Skyrim shit. And it's all incredibly oh, yeah. stupid and I love it. High tier Skyrim nonsense from that dude. <laughs> yeah. And I remember the McElroy brothers. Uh, like they used to do some Skyrim stuff. They did like really slutty skyrim for a while does anyone else remember that did i hallucinate that i they did like think you did i vaguely remember that yeah with yeah. like skyrim but like they had like a ton of sex mods and stuff and it's like mm -hmm. they were actually like like there were lizard people like humping each other and he was like trying to have a conversation with them i did not hallucinate <laughs> that that happened i don't i don't know if i saw that but i, I, I did not hallucinate it it happened i guarantee it happened I need to get some of this junk out of my inventory, like really and truly. But let's see. Oh, oh, great. Okay, so everything is spoiling. That's fantastic. That's actually good. Let me check on. Do we have any? No, we don't have any. Hmm. Okay, so I'll have to make a few. 
I will have to make some boards. Not a problem, because I just put some of these away. And if I'm not mistaken, yeah, the saw is still good. Let's make some boards. That'll do. Because remember, we are very, very close to having so much rot. More rot than we know what to do with. <laughs> there we go. Let's just make two barrels. Okay, and look at that. Carrot and meat stew is done. Okay. It's dangerous walking out here, but the rift activity is currently calm, so I'm not too worried. Put that there. Yeah, I am out in the middle of like a swamp and there is a wolf howling nearby. Yeah. And I'm <laughs> Whereas I've got I'm a lot of stuff on me. I'm a little worried. Making stew, baking pies, crafting barrels. Um, and I think I'm going to make myself a fourth backpack now. Just making mistakes. I think. Shall I? I think I'll put this someplace it won't block people. So right there should be plenty. There we go. And anybody in here? can take a good squeeze in. Yeah, the red currants and God, it's the blueberries that I'm really concerned about. They're going to go bad super duper fast. So I think I will make some blueberry squeezins. Yeah, you're still honey. That's fine. And oh, right, right, right. You're just like, you still have a ton of garbage in you, don't you? All right, give me your Suddenly garbage. I realize that I'm not really sure how I got to where I am right now. <laughs> that sounds like a you problem. Yeah. But. And bucket. Where did I put that bucket? It's over here, isn't it? Honestly, I thought we had three buckets. We probably do, and I've just lost track of the third one. It could be one down by the lake or something. Uh-huh. Yeah. I am mashing the blueberries because they, despite the fact they were being stored very carefully in the larder, are going bad fastest. And I don't want all that effort to be for, for naught, basically. It is very nice of this game to tell you how long stuff is going to last. Oh, yeah. So, That's a very nice feature. Okay, so you're just going to do your thing. And I don't, God, I still just, I don't have the inventory space to, to be fucking around in the greenhouse right now. I'll have to take care of that later. Okay. And let's go ahead and just put you like that. And you'll just be juice we can drink, I guess. Blueberry juice. Why not, right? Okay. Blueberry juice sounds intense. It does, doesn't it? I would, I would love some blueberry juice. And here, we'll just put you in. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Sounds good. And there we go. Just get these blueberries the heck out of there and actually huh. oh is there literally not enough in there to squeeze huh. there's literally not enough in there <sighs> okay. to squeeze crazy where do i go next is there really not enough container wow it's literally not enough okay well how long are you good for can I just eat you? No, I can't. Okay. Well, that was a mistake. <sighs> Hopefully some blueberries will get good. If not, it'll just have to be... It'll just have to be pig food. There we go. And pies, pies. All right, yeah, okay. I think I've mitigated the berry overflow to a reasonable degree. That's good. Yeah, that's all black currant. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, okay, cool. And we still have our little jug and our bowl over here so we can drink from these. But most of it is being converted to wine as we speak, which is fine. Okay. Now, I wanted a barn, but I have to get this junk out of my freaking inventory. 54, 68. Okay. Well, let's see how much inventory space we can free up. I don't need to be carrying that. I don't need to be carrying that. I can put away that and okay and i was informed on twitter and i think in here 
that if I wanted more sticks, I had to actually cut the leaves myself. So yeah, yeah, someone did mention that. <gasps> Yay, we got a we got it though. Are you dead? I think you're dead. The the side that does that? Yeah. That's oh, cool. Okay, so this this pumpkin plant died and I don't think it gave me much of anything. Oh. That sucks. Yeah. I've really been struggling with those things. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's Yeah, it's dead. Okay. Well, that's fine though. Because I am going to plant another pumpkin plant over there. I think I have it fertilized so I can do that. Yeah. I'm going to just plant another pumpkin over there. I'm going to be determined. Oh, sheep. I've got to go out on the lake and look for those sheep I saw recently. Because I want to actually domesticate some goddamn sheep, too. Yeah, we are not going to get dairy in our lives without that. Yeah. And Okay, so here's a pumpkin. Give me a pumpkin, and I can make pumpkin seeds from that. Right, right, good, right. Okay. Wolf. Oh, you fucker. Nope. <laughs> I am in the water. I rule here. You cannot fuck with me. <laughs> Sounds like wolf issues. Do you dare? Do you dare? <laughs> Let me know how it goes. There we go. I am not going to death spiral. I will not. Did you die? Not no, yet. I also got loads and loads of poultices on me. Good, good, good. Okay. Now. Oh, hey, I got some. Oh, uh, she ran off. Fuck you. Ah. Okay. I also Wolf. have some, some rot to put away. So let's take care of that. Wolf, you must pay the penalty. <laughs> Listen to you. Okay. Ha. And the rest of you are just spoiling away. the stone away. at her and killed okay, her. Good, good, good. Oh, wait a minute. I don't. Oh, yeah. I don't have room in my inventory. Just harvest. Any of her growing, goodies. Mature. Shit. Okay, well. Growing, 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 growing. Mature. Mature. Yes, I'll take this stuff. God. I'm going to be so happy this winter because we are not going to be fucking starving and just being all like, oh my god, we can't do anything because we, we're too busy looking for stringy wolf meat to eat. Hmm. Now, growing, growing, growing. Hey, what are you doing here? Get out of here. Mature. Mature. Man, that's a lot of onions. Okay. And that's it? Okay. We're all good? Besides that? All of you are just growing. You're not mature. You're growing. And you are carrots. Okay, cool. And it is... Yeah, 50. So it's going to be like 22, 23. So nothing that can't take 22, 23. And, you know, nitrogen crop would be good from the looks of things. Everybody kind of wants a nitrogen crop that can take 25 degrees Celsius. Okay. Duly noted. Duly noted. Nitrogen crop that can take 25 degrees Celsius. You got to remember to both rotate your crops and make sure that they can tolerate the heat or cold, everybody. So, yeah, I can see. this can got some depth in that nitrogen regard. Nitrogen crops. Oh, the spelt. The spelt can absolutely do it. Okay. And we could use a little more grain. Okay. I'm being a real homebody so far tonight, aren't I? But so much stuff around here needs doing. We're getting it done. Yeah. We have to. <laughs> oh, hey. Oh. Hello, mature cabbage. These are these are all things that you've been working very hard to get to work on. Yes. Okay. And okay, so and you're all still growing. Okay. And if I'm not mistaken, yeah, there's a few things over here. Oof. Yeah. Let's get you planted up in here. And you are mature. Fantastic. Oh dear, can I not? Oh dear, dear, dear. Can't pick you up, can I? Hmm. Uh, yeah. Guess I can't. Guess I can't. That's fine. I'll come back for you in a second. Okay.
God, I don't know how I feel about these oak trees growing so huge next to our house. Might have to do something about it. Hmm. Oak trees, huh? Yes. Huh. Now... And what did I just dig up? What was that? Oh, wow, we got a lot of onions, didn't we? That's a lot of onions. Okay. Yeah, I think I know the trees you're talking about. Now, I think 64 about it. Yeah. onions. And a bunch more cabbages. That's pretty good. And cabbage seeds can go here. Cool. Okay, am I carrying anything else around? Oh, wow, more than 64. Another 32 onions. That's a lot of onions. Okay. All right, I think that's good. I could check on the beehives again. Speaking of which, I hear bees right now. Oh, cool. Mark them on the map. You never know. Yeah, okay. Definitely don't just, like, destroy wild beehives. Absolutely not. The orchard is coming in pretty nice. Um, cool. How are we oh, doing, cool. bees? Okay, oh. We got one getting ready to give up some honey. Just one, though. Okay, that's fine. I can wait since I can't do anything until I have two more helpings of honey. Ooh, yeah, there's some bees here, all right. Oh, dear. More black currants just got ripe. But anyway, before it gets dark, let's there just it is. put that there. And let's go cut down a pine tree. What do you say? Like this one, this big ass pine tree right wow, that's a tall one, huh? Okay. Tell you what, since I wanna try and get some pine cones out of this, let's just use the packed dirt and just nerd pole our way up. Alright. Give me a pine cone. 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 And sticks. Sticks will be good, too. Give me a pine cone or sticks. Well, I haven't gotten us into the Iron Age yet, but I am coming home with good. such an amazing supply of poultice ingredients. Good. Huh. Yeah, I'm definitely getting much better sticks from taking out the leaves first. Wow. That is great. It's doing a number on this crappy little It's shockingly axe, short but... supply. It's doing a number on this oh. crappy little axe, but that's fine. Oh, you're using an axe? I thought it was a scythe. Hmm. Yeah. Wow. This is great. And I hurt myself, but that's fine. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. This is great. I'm going to have to do this from now on. But anyway. Let's see if I can just bring this whole thing down, because I want some logs. It might destroy this axe. We'll have to see. Come on, buddy. I guess now that we're in a place where it doesn't matter, I can think about making an axe. You know, like a bronze axe. Honestly, yeah. I, I think that's perfectly reasonable. Even a knife. Yeah. We certainly that's have a, enough. Knives all the time. Oh, wow. Look at that. Four. Great Perfect. all the time. Yeah, that was a really good thing. Thank you, whoever suggested that. Touch yeah. the Skyrim. Yes, Wailing Octopus, it was called Touch the Skyrim. Thank you. It absolutely yeah. happened. It was real. Yeah. And then suddenly, like, the McElroys, like, people stopped, like, liking them as much. And I never figured out how, but whatever. Mm. Like, everyone was talking about them. Everyone was super into them. It just feels very, like... So everyone here is familiar with, like, SoundCloud rappers, right? We all know about those guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like... Where are you going with this? I can't wait to hear. No, SoundCloud rappers are these dudes who have this meteoric, meteoric rise to fame, right? Like, so I, I wouldn't say they them, all do, but a lot of them do. Have it these, is like, a phenomenon. Yeah, this meteoric rise to fame, and everyone scene. like can't get enough of them, and like licks their asshole clean and thinks they're amazing, think they hung the moon, as someone's grandma might say. And then suddenly they're not cool anymore, and everyone hates them for some reason. I would never say that about a SoundCloud rapper. What the fuck is that? I'm so far away. Oh, what is God, going on? I almost on? had a fucking heart attack. Okay, uh, I found a dead rooster by our house. Oh, that's not good. It's not one of yours, though, right? 
Um, I don't believe so. If it is, that's a hell of a feat. Okay. I think something killed it, but I don't think it was... As long as it's not your rooster, then, uh, then that's fine. Uh, that rooster can be dead if it wants to. I don't mind. Everything's looking fine in there. But this is really making me want to hurry up and build that goddamn barn. Yeah. Whew, okay, but anyway, let's just plant these pine trees because we have to replenish. I have this feeling of being out in the wilderness. I don't know how this blocky goddamn game manages <laughs> to achieve it, but it is real. I'm gonna actually murder this chicken, I think. I'm gonna fucking do it. I'm gonna fucking do it. Oh. Oh, come on! Oh, I call. Okay. I'm getting offended. Oh. I cannot believe that just happened to me. Nobody saw that. <laughs> I'm so offended by everything that just happened. What did occur? I was shamed. I was publicly shamed. You gotta share it with me, because I can't see the stream right now. I was right ridiculed. Now. I, I was, I'm enraged by the occurrences. Do I have any oh. knives? I don't have any knives. I have to actually make a knife. What kind of fucking world do we live in? Okay. Let me just go make a knife real quick. But yeah, I threw like four or five spears and every single one of them missed. And it's like, what the fuck? Oh, that like, ain't like on. you at all. Yeah, I, I, I was, it was a travesty. It was offensive. It, it, it's not appropriate. <laughs> okay. So, let's just do that. And... You know what? Let's make another axe, too, while we're here. Because I have to go get a lot of pine. Are Cooper's reeds used to make barrels? Um... Is that why they're no, called that? I, I couldn't tell you. Um, not in this game. I'm not aware of... Like, I, mean, nice. I guess Cooper's reeds could be a real thing, but they look like cattails to me. Yeah. I think, it's, I think I found more bees. Oh, wow. I don't remember bees being this easy to stumble across. This is what happens in this game. As soon as you find the thing that you've been looking for forever, all of a sudden, they are everywhere. Yeah, basically. There we go. And... Where's that axe head? There we go. All right. Now, work to do. We'll go carve up that chicken, but first... Yeah, let's just get the chicken first, actually. Okay, so we're going to do this again. Oh, it's running. Fuck. Where is it? <sighs> Never mind, then. Let's just get the chicken in the water. take care of this before it gets dark out. Wow, a lot of feathers. And let's go get some pine trees. Like these pine trees over here. Because I have an aesthetic I am working towards, folks. Mm -hmm. I have an aesthetic. Put that there. And... Now, do I have room for this? I don't. I sure as shit don't. Okay. God, that windmill is ridiculous looking. I've got to fix that. Windmill? It looks like a windmill. Well, you know. it just It's just on a stick. Well. It's goofy. It looks like a pinwheel. It doesn't look right. I have to fix it. I understand what you mean. Okay, and so that's that. Seal that. Compost away. And you. There we go. You can get started. Okay. And yeah. All right. Now, where was I? 
Let's get going on destroying this forest. Making something that was once beautiful, ugly, and dead. Okay. And now, from now on, I'm just gonna always take care of things with a knife first, like this. Because I want sticks and pine cones. There we go. And this is actually safer, because, uh... I've had shit sneak up on me while I was doing this in the past, and now it'll have a lot harder time killing me. This is truly the correct way to go about things. Man, yeah, the stick concentration is just way better. That, that is very good. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is just a huge improvement. Hmm. Okay. Although I might, since we are kind of rolling in it at this point, make some uh, bronze axes and bronze knives. I think that's perfectly reasonable. Now I have, wow, that's so much easier. It's so much easier. Okay. Come on, buddy. Look at that, four pine cones. God, that is so much easier. Yeah, I gotta do that from now on. Oh, I'm about to starve to death. Hurry up, buddy. Come on. I suppose you could take this on, could you? If you could, that'd be great. Oh, I'm about to start screaming. I knew it. There I go. <laughs> the stick famine oh. has ended. Yes, Sakari. Now we actually aren't like hurting for sticks every second of the day. Indeed. All right. Look at that. Yeah. Woo. Perfect. Now, before I leave. Let me just plant these. Yeah, yeah, you'll get stew. Hold on. There we go. Now, back to the house. Yeah, yeah. You'll get it, don't worry. It's coming. <laughs> okay. There. Stew. All right. And more stew. Perfect. And more. even more stew. There. You're good now. Yeah, it's getting up there. Oh, I can eat a little bit of fruit. I'll have to remember that. And... Yeah, some black currants got ripe. So maybe I can get that juice after all, right? No, no, no. Okay, so are any of you ripe? I'm not seeing anything. Any ripe black currants? No, I think we got y'all. I think we got y'all. That's ten, though. I bet I could. Hmm. I wonder. Dry. Yeah, okay. Let's just head down here right, then. 16112. See if we can't change things up a little bit. Yeah. What? There we go. And protein. There's the protein. There, you can live in there. And let's see if I can't sell. Oh, it's black currants, not. That's right. Oh, well, never mind. This is blueberry, not black currant. Black currant's going on here. Being very domestic this time around. Very domestic. Mm. But I can't you help it. There's so much that needs doing. Right There's so yeah. much that needs doing. But 
Hopefully in a little while, uh, we'll get a giant pile of drifters attacking us, and we'll get temporal gear, and we'll get to activate the next uh, yeah. uh, translocator. Right now, though, what I am thinking of is chickens. Hmm. Like, new. Crap, I'm going to need my axe if I'm going to do this real. Come on. Yep, there we go. Okay. <laughs> so, how about if I do it like this? Okay, so that works. And I have a vision for this. So, okay. Okay. All right. Okay. And then, yeah, all right. And then you go back like this. And like the door can be. All right, so it's one, two. Three, four, five. So the door's here. This is where the door will be. Okay. Let's see then. I'm gonna have to figure that one out a little bit. Oh, cool. Coming along. So that's two pumpkins. Not bad. Not bad. 88 growth speed. Okay. Tolerable. 88 over there too. Cool. So I will very slowly but surely build up my pumpkin supply. And you know what, while I'm over here, let's just check on the chickens. Panicking their poor little heads off in here. But that's because of me. Okay, and 17 hours until those hatch, that's great. Okay ladies, how's it going? Now, are, is there a boy in here somewhere? There should be. Are you crushed in this corner? Hen, hen, I think you... Oh, there you are, rooster. There he is. So that's okay. fine. Um, it looks like we still only have the one rooster, though. Looks like we still just have the one original rooster. That sucks. But that's kind of normal for this game. Okay, so you are a generation one, generation one. I know there are some gen twos in there. Come on now. Generation two. Oh, you're a hen. You're a hen. Okay. You know what that means? It's time for you to die. It's time for the Gen 1s to die. Okay, you're Gen 2, so you live. You're Gen 1. Get out of the corner! Okay. Oh, okay, you are Generation 1. Ah. Gotcha. That's Generation 1. That's Generation 2. Generation 1, Generation 2. The brown one's the one I want. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Generation two. Generation one. Damn it! This is so painful. There, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, so that's two. See, I have to kill. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! How am I not hitting that one? Is this a joke? Come on now. I'm killing all the generation ones because they are not going to be as tame as the generation twos. Now are you a, you're a generation one. Okay, come on. Well, I, I have to be very careful not to kill the rooster though. You're a gen two, gen two, gen two. Ugh. I can't kill anything in that corner because the rooster's in that corner. Okay. And the thing is, I can't fucking... Okay. Are these all... Oh, gotcha. Okay. And these are... Okay, so you're... Generation 2. Okay, so I think you're both generation one. Oh shit, I'm gonna starve. Okay, um, gotta come home now. Oh That's boy. Fine. <laughs> wow. Oh boy. I'm gonna be eating poultices on the way home. That's okay. Generation two. Okay. Hmm. 
Uh, get out of the corner. Your friend won't save you. Get out of the corner. 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 Come on. Okay. And you're Gen 2. Perfect. All right. And you are... Oh, I see a Generation well, Hen, Generation 1, and Hen, Generation 1. Are you both Generation 1? I think. No, the rooster's there. Oh my god, don't fucking run in front of my knife. Ugh. Ah. Move. Rifters. Expected. Oh, you're so annoying. Move. You know mm. what? Fine. Where's my knife? Oh, I just want to kill the Generation Ooh. 1 hens. Okay. Now, are you Generation 1? You are. There we go. Don't want you Gen 1 hens. <laughs> Farquhar, I just got here. Is the house fixed? God, no. God, no. <laughs> <laughs> Soon, but not now. Oh, God. I am just culling the Generation 1 hens right now. Mm. There we go. There were a lot of them, but I don't need them no more. go and there we go oh god i'm so hungry <laughs> there's food there's food where's food oh ever you know, it'll be easy to find you'll know oh, thank you yes oh all god. right and okay. oh that's not enough that is there should more. be some in the firewood fireplace oh, okay no no it's okay it's okay okay oh. Thank you. All right. Now, ladies. Generation 2. Generation. Looks like you're all Gen 2. Oh, hey, uh, where should I put wolf meat? Uh, downstairs? Downstairs. Okay. Okay, so you're... Ah, hello. Okay. We... Uh, oh, wait. We really need more room in our plant products box hmm. here because um i just brought home a stupid amount of horse tails and cat tails okay hmm. all right now i've killed your moms oh i see one generation one but you're gonna have to move so i can get her your generation two so this little red hen is a generation one get out of the way everyone there we go that's how you do it There we go. All right. Now, two, 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 two. Pretty sure these are tier, t these are gen two eggs. So let's just destroy that. Put these back. Okay. And you are... Wait, good. I will get you some more to eat. Get out of the door. Let's just take care of this now. I killed a lot of chickens. No more greedy Gen 1 hens. Hmm. And I have some eggs, finally. So let's just head downstairs and put that in the protein area. There we go. Wow, look at all that. Okay. And five eggs. That can go there. There we go. Perfect. Yeah. And I have 119 <laughs> feathers and a whole bunch of bones, too. Mm. Now, let me just... Muddy gravel. Fuck this. Muddy gravel is useless. No, muddy gravel you can't sift, yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna. There we go. And There's like literally no value to this. I'm throwing yep. it away. And you know what? Before I do anything else, now that I've killed all the Gen 1 chickens, so the Gen 2 chickens can focus on eating a bunch 
and laying some Gen 3 eggs for me. Ooh, a nice lamp. Okay, so you all are Gen 2, right? You should be. Okay. There we go. Okay. Oh, That's you were not kidding about these trees. Yep. They are encroaching. They are, aren't they? You can do something about that. And there we go. Okay. Now, what was I doing? What was Ooh, I doing? More blueberries. Oh, more blueberries? Is that what you said? More blueberries. Yep. Okay. Well, give them to me so I can make mash out of them. Don't you worry. Let me just make sure that I've got everything here. Oh. Dry mash, huh? Oh, you're dry. Okay, so you're... Okay, you're garbage. All right, got it, got it. Wrong mash. Let's get the wet blueberry mash. Okay. Now, get put that back in there. Where'd you run off to? There you are. Gimme blueberries. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Let's see. Perfect. Yes. Now you will mash. Yes. Oh, you need a certain amount for it to actually. Yeah, I, I didn't no. have enough, and now I do. Ah, handy. So now that is an extra 6.87 liters of blueberry juice. <laughs> Which is good because blueberries rot so freaking fast. Mm. But as juice, they'll still it'll stay good for a month. Pretty good. It's simply the right choice. Okay. Medium rift activity, and I do hear drifters around. Okay, so I'm going to head in. for A light temporal storm is approaching. Ooh, really? Okay. A light temporal storm well, is approaching. Well, maybe we, maybe we should actually um, do a little fighting instead of just hiding. Well, I actually had stuff I had planned to do for the evening, so <laughs> <laughs> you could fight. Uh, we need a temporal gear. Oh, that's right. I mean, yeah. I have nowhere I can put this phalarite. Our ore chest is full. Hold on, let me just put some of oh, these crappy spears away. There we go. I'm going to have to just put it the stones. Yeah. Um, I've got. I well, I'll probably it. be throwing a whole bunch of stones tonight, so. Well, don't accidentally throw this phalarite. I won't. Um, and I will turn the stones uh, that I had to take out of there into cobble. And you know what? I'm going to actually get going on a few things. Like all of this. Okay. And there's no point in having this little bismuthonite one here. One, two, three. Oh, oh my god, oh, can food! I... <laughs> there we go. And now if you want some traveling food, remember we have pies and game meat in the in the basement, so. Yeah, I've got nowhere to put the bush meat that I just brought back. Um, yeah. You can take the bush meat that I'll I cooked. I'll put it with the vegetables. You can That's, take the oh. bu bush meat I cooked and put that in your inventory and use that as like walking that around food. It's an excellent idea. Thank you. Okay. Now, what did I want to do here? I believe what I want. Make sure all the doors are closed. Make sure nothing mm -hmm. can get in. Make sure everything's well lit. Okay. You want a bunch of poultices, like a fucking bunch? I mean, I already have 16 on me, but I won't say no. Okay, like, because really, I could I could make a lot. I've got so many okay, makes uh, ingredients here. Okay. And um, here's another 16 for you. Thank you. In case you run into trouble. Thank you. I'm going to keep an extra bunch on me, and I'm going to put a bunch more 
I am going to make a couple of knives and a couple of axes, I think. That's a good idea. Oop, didn't mean to do that. There we go. Couple knives and couple axes coming right up. And over here. Oh, look at that. We have five huge soaked hides. Go ahead and scrape those. Where's my knife? All right. Wow. Took a lot out of my knife. So now we have five huge scraped hides. Do we have any wheat um, tannin? We sure do. Actually, we've got so many um, poultices now, I'm putting them in a crate. <laughs> they are now a crate item. And, okay. So, all right. That's coming along. That's fine. And I have my hammer. And I have all that leather. I'm just doing literally nothing with. So. I think I'm just kind of. Maybe if I take all this. And move it. If I move this. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Perfect. Fuck off. And take this, put it there. You love to see it. That's four, count them four, leather backpacks. Oh, rad. Yeah. Oh, time to take care of oh, you, I think. Speaking of leather, I was waiting for leather to X, 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 X. make this bow. But I also have to wait for the bow to dry. Is it? It's dry. Oh, it's dry. Okay. Have you got one piece of leather? Yes, if you come get it. It's in the uh, leather working chest. Okay. Thank you. That is exactly what I needed. I also need flax twine. Oh, we've got so much. Where is it? Check the plant stuff. Oh, okay. There's flax fibers from which I can make flax twine. Yeah. We have so much flax now, it's kind of embarrassing. That's wonderful. I hear portals out there. Just barely. Yeah. Uh, for folks who don't know, Temporal sp Storm is when the nuisance creatures of this game... You know how Minecraft has zombies? This game has something called drifters, which are equally, if not more, annoying. And they are near worthless to actually engage in combat. Because normally, they hardly drop anything even worth writing home about. But yeah. during temporal storms, temporal storms, slightly stronger versions of them do spawn. And... Uh, Sometimes it can be worth it to engage them during temporal storms, but again, they are stronger versions of themselves. So yeah, yeah, this is going to be interesting. Okay, so I've got a longbow now. Mm -hmm. um, I'm very excited about this. Now it's time to start carrying arrows again. Um, God knows we've got a lot of feathers. You can make as many as you like. Hey. Hmm. Okay, I am I'm ready to kill lots of drifters. Well, I'm sure the temporal storm will be here soon. Yeah, I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna go be a fool and walk around outside. Okay. That is between you and God, sir. Mm hmm. When you yeah, come back sure. in, I will have, yeah. When you come back in, I will have an axe, a tin bronze axe for you. Oh, nice! And I'm gonna make some knives too, just to see how long they last. Yeah, yeah. Worth a try. Yeah, we certainly got enough of this stuff now. So, okay, okay, so. No, you know what? I want a chisel, too. So let's make a knife. Okay, moss, chisel, cleaver, plate. No, there's a... Can I just not make a tin bronze knife? Where is it? Shovel, spear. 
scythe, saw blade. You know what? I'll make a saw blade. I'm not seeing. Oh, there's a knife. Okay. Oh, I hear them. I hear them. I don't see anything out here yet. I hear, I heard some like that, that they do. I hear it. Oh God, little fuckers. I hear them. Okay. Hopefully they won't spawn in the house anymore now that we're so well lit. Yeah. Oh, I hear them, dude. I absolutely hear them. Oh my god, they're so fucking close, it's actually kind of disconcerting. Not seeing anything. I'll, I'm gonna come back over towards the house. Yeah, they are so fucking loud. I might not be hearing them because just the rain is very loud outside. I hear that they must be bunched up against the wall because they're not spawning in Oh, one now, hell yeah. Okay. <laughs> Good luck. Helted with rocks. Okay, ow. Knife. You know what? I'm going to make a solid. Blade. No, you know what? Oh, I guess Where I have no choice fucker? after I choose. Okay, fair enough. Whoa, my gear is spinning. Yeah. Yeah, I hear them. I absolutely fucking hear them. Oh, there are three of them right by the corner of the house. Yeah, they're probably... Oh, there's another. They're probably trying to get at me. Oh, totally, yeah. In fact, I'm not even going to come in through that door because it's too mobbed with them. Yeah. Oh, there's another one around the other side, though. This might let it in. Okay. Yeah, so it's happening. Yeah. Where are you? I'm over by the forge. Oh, no, I'm talking to them. Oh. All right. Didn't even try to harvest them during this. <laughs> Glad I got all those poultices. Yeah, well, I got 32 on me if you ever need a re-up. Oh, yeah, we've got a fucking crate full upstairs. We are going to be just fine. Yes. Just got to remember the old rule from so many different games. Don't get greedy. Yep. Oh. Wow! Yeah, yeah, that corner of the house is just loaded with them. Yep. I can hear them. They're so annoying. They're right in my ear. It feels like they're right behind me. Oh. Uh oh. What? 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 Uh, it's getting funky out here. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Visual effects and all. Uh huh. Oh. But it just passed. That was fast. It's odd. I suddenly feel secure enough to harvest. Let me know if you find anything good. Because remember, we have yeah. that. We have that tel translocator. Oh, tel don't you worry. I'm never forgetting that. Yeah. It'd be cool if we could get a temporal. So far, I'm not finding so much as twine. Oh, okay, it's funky again. Uh huh. Oh, weird. It's coming in like pulses. Oh man, I'm my temporal stability is uh, a little bit depleted, like noticeably, which is not something that happens often. Okay. Ooh, it's it's yeah. quiet out here now, though. Let's see. Okay. And... Fuckers in there with the chickens. <laughs> they always wind up in there. It's so irritating. Yeah, I'm not going to bother with it because uh, I don't want to hurt the chickens. Yeah, just leave them alone. By the way, what is your carrying capacity like? Are you on linen sacks or leather or what? I, um, Two leather, two linen. Two linen, two... Okay, so I'm going to put this excess linen sack away then. And I'm going wow, to... I think that uh, temporal storm was just not what we were hoping for. Aww. So what is this up here? 
copper size. And <laughs> that is how much our situation has changed. Yeah, seriously, where we're like, oh boy, it's time to murder. <laughs> okay. I just I really. There we go. So I did a bunch. Desperately of need that gear. There. Rather, excuse me, bronze working there. Um and oh yeah, I don't need to carry around fucking flint anymore. Flint, patu, patu on flint. No more flint for me. There we go. I'll use up the flint that I've got. Yeah. And, however, I I will take with me. Um. You. Let me just put you up here. And I will take with me you. Huh. Although it looks like... What time is it? Okay, two. I'm going to make a couple more things, I think. Because, uh, yeah. Matter of fact, you know what? Let me see the, the ore situation here. Wow, we have so much tin. Five units of tin. Okay, yeah. Let's see. There we go. Ooh, no, didn't mean to do that. 23. 33. Okay. Good enough. So, let's go ahead and take you. Oh, wow. And... Hmm. Okay, I'm actually uh, going to head back out. Good. Um, that... Uh, back to do uh, prospecting, because that was not nearly as... as... Uh, Worrisome as I thought. Okay. Kind of hoped. Let's just take some of that and just make more tin, shall we? Hmm. Yeah, I think I will make more tin, actually. Let's get you. And... Man, so I think there was a time when a temporal storm was like I was getting ready for a siege. Well, we were screaming in terror the entire time. Just safely throwing rocks from the balcony. <laughs> hey, I still love throwing rocks from the balcony. I'll hear no no negative words over about throwing well, I, rocks I'm from actually, the balcony. I'm still really impressed with what rocks can do. Yeah. I, I, these days I follow your advice and I have a stack of rocks on me all the time. Yeah, it's good. It's it's just sensible. Yeah, yeah. Now. The fact that you can bank shot them off stuff is really impressive. Like, I... I wouldn't have expected the physics to work like that in this game, and that's that's really cool. So let's put you in here, and okay, so thirty-two ten, and then. And then all right, so we want 20. Oh, look at that. Got to go get more. Wow. Okay. Well, come here, you. There we go. That ought to do the job, hopefully. So you're not going to believe this. We're about to run out of copper. Out of what? Copper. Copper? Copper? Oh my god. A okay, light temporal well, storm is imminent. Oh boy, well that'll make prospecting interesting. Oh, I don't know. Maybe you should come home. I might. I might, depending on how things go. Okay, there we go. I really might. So that's... Because while there's like nothing at home, it will be different out here. So that's going to be that. So... Two, four, six, eight. I don't think we need this many, though. Yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Maybe ten. Let's do that. There we go. Ten. So that'll be eight ingots. Oh, temporal storm. Oh, here we go. Here we are. Yeah. It's happening. Okay. Looking around, being careful. 
Don't want to just be ambushed in my own home by fucking super assholes. Yeah. Not seeing anything yet. I'm getting visual effects out here. I'm definitely getting visual effects. Okay, yeah, and there's... There are There's a crowd! Oh, no, no, it's in the house! It's in the Ooh, house! It's boy. in the house! It's in the house! Okay, I'll come home. I just saw a uh, one of those horned ones just spawn right in front of me. It's in the house. It, I, no light, no light level seems safe enough. It's in the house. Fortunately, the um, the path blocks that the tunnel is paved with seem to prevent them from spawning. Oh my god! There's nothing it's showing literally up in, here. in the house. It's in the house. You're gonna walk in, and it's gonna be right there. It's okay. Oh, and it's a strong one, dude. Ooh. Oh, that's less okay. I'm, I keep trying to get a bead on it to throw a rock at it, but I, I can't. Yeah, just be careful. I'm showing up, and I am well prepared. Yay, 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 yay! I'll take any risks. Oh, I think there's more than one now. More than one strong one? Yeah. You know what? I think it's time you and I had a serious talk about rebuilding this house on half slabs. Um, why not just use path? I don't want to make path blocks in my home. But you move faster on them. They're hideous. They are hideous, admittedly. But there is a similar problem with slabs, remember. Yeah. Ooh. Are you okay, in the I'm house in the basement. yet? Hello? In the basement? I'm, a, I'm in the attic. I don't see anything here yet. There is something in the, in the bedroom. bedroom. It's in the bedroom. Oh, yeah, there is. Oh, that's a bad one. Okay. Yeah. I am not getting in melee range if I can help it. You throw rocks at me. You don't get to touch me. <laughs> oh, okay, stay away from it. I'm trying. I'm I'm, just let me shoot arrows at it. Really, get away. Okay. Oh, I, I want to shoot it, not you. I can't oh, believe it holy fucking shit, spawned dude. in here. What kind of bullshit was that? Uh, anything up in the attic? No, oh, but I do okay. have five of your arrows. Oh. Okay, I'm going to butcher this thing. Wax. Boo. At least it's not like a super bad temporal storm. Is there anything spawning in here? It's really not, no. No. Like the fucking nerve of it spawning in this house. How dare you? <laughs> as well lit as it is. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at you. You want in, don't you, buddy? I'm going up on the, uh... Ugh. I'm going up on the balcony to throw rocks. Fucking noises these things make. Oh, I did not mean to close that door with me on this side of it. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Hey, look, it's me. I'm so scared and easy to get up here. Oh, they're all going after you. Okay. There's a real bad one behind you. Yeah. I'm not thrilled with that. Maybe they're more likely to uh, drop temporal gears, though. Yeah, so. there definitely are. Except he's running away, which means he's pretty badly hurt, so... Ah, fucker, where are you? There you are. Wow. Arrows letting me down. Hmm. There we go. Okay, I don't see any more. There are definitely... You, you dropped some arrows underneath the balcony, by the way. Well, I'm leaving arrows everywhere. Okay. Look at that effect, everybody. Ah, now it's dead. Look at that, seriously. Oh, it is really one nice, just spawned yeah. in near Dead Wolf Lake. Um, okay. Oh, and one's chasing you. Yeah, where is it? Where is the f Oh, I got ah. him, don't worry. There, motherfucker. I'll take care of him. Oh, okay. Oh, another one just oh! spawned right in. Uh oh, I don't like that. That was so goofy, I hate that shit. My arrows do not seem to be flying straight right now. Oh, 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 ow, ow, ow. Okay, that was bad. Now I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm coming in, and I'm going to patch myself up for a sec. 
and then I'm gonna go back out. Ooh! Oh my! Oh my goodness! Grab some more poultices. And then I'm going back out. Yeah, they're running. No! Yeah, one went to North Lake for sure. Yep, see it. At least I have a lot of rod. Where did it go? Oh. Oh, it's in the water. What's up, fucker? Oh, it despawned. Ah, you fucker. <sighs> okay. Okay, let's do some harvesting. Oh, oh I One see it. One hit me from behind. I'm on it. Oh, it's tainted. Yep, got it. Oh, okay, good, good, good. Now, where right, is butcher. my knife? Hey, jackpot! Temporal? Temporal gear. Excellent. Okay, folks, we are going through another translocator today. But first, let's kill this one. Oh, nothing in that one. So that worked. Another one in the chicken coop. Yep. <laughs> It'll be there a while. Yeah. I'm going to go see if any uh, fell down here. Don't think so. Doesn't look like it. Okay, cool. I'm going to... Ooh, let me just go put all this liters here. of rot away. Oh, there you are. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Now. Deep Drifter! Oh, shit. <laughs> And... Whoop! Okay. Fucker. Oh, you think you're funny. Ah! This corrupt drifter just beat my ass! Yeah, they hit hard. I don't think they throw their rocks any harder, but their melee damage ah! is horrifying. Let me let me arrow it to death because dang it, they're, no, they're not a big deal at range. I softened it up for you. You definitely did. Let me just heal myself up here. Wow, I'm glad you gave me all those poultices. Yeah, poultices there are wonderful. <sighs> all right. Now, where were we? <laughs> I'm going to drop uh, all this stuff back off at home because we have a temporal gear now. And yeah, that yeah, means yeah, it's yeah. time to explore. Let's get a little bit of food and then just head right yeah, out. Yeah, seriously. Let me actually just uh, put away. Well, I've got. I've still got a bunch of bush meat on me. You want half this? Uh, sure. Throw it on me. Um. And there you uh, go. Oh. What was that what for? <laughs> oh. Oh, you know, oh, I think I, I must have hit you with my poultice, which is <laughs> ironic. Okay. Um, okay. And I'm just going to put away all these pine logs that I gathered because I want to make the chicken coop. So let me just really quickly. Need a little more food than and that. And I'm going to also put away this excess copper and casserite. And this so black currant mash is still out there. trying to figure out how to go bad. I'm going to let it do that. And I don't need to be carrying around this sack. I can put the sack away because I have four backpacks now. Oh. And I'm going to put away all this stuff because since we're going on the other end of a teleporter, I don't want to die with all this good shit on me. So let's put that there. Mm. Now, translocator Strictly four speaking, is don't need to be carrying around a little that. to the north, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so... It's on the other side of North Lake. And let me just put this here and this here. And I don't need to be carrying around our entire supply of black coal. Thank you very much. Nor do I need oh. to be carrying that around. 
Huh. I thought I put that that sock that sack away. Guess not. Okay. Um. So. Ready? Not yet. Um. Let me go ahead and put the coal away. Put the copper away. Put the sack away. Thought I did this, but I guess I didn't. And okay. Um. Maybe put stones up here. And I'm going to continue to let these rot in my inventory. Let me just eat this cooked bush meat. Keep forgetting about uh, how you should not hold something in your offhand unless yeah. you need it. And I'm going to go ahead and take a bowl. And I'm going to take that with me. Yeah. That'll be my food. So it's definitely a full bowl, I'm sure of it this time. Let me put away these liters of rot. And I have my temporal gear. I have my knife. I'm good to go. Let's do it. Lead the way. Okay. Well, you know the way for this one. I think didn't didn't you mark this one first? Uh, yeah, you I don't found know. this one. Oh did yeah, I? Yeah, we're headed north. Okay, I'm following you. Let's just head like around the east side of the God, north I Lake. hope this spits us out someplace interesting. Yeah. Honestly, I and any time you get to a new place in this game, it's yeah. always fun because it feels like you are far away from home in like a strange and wild place. Now's a perfect time to do it too. We don't have to worry about a temporal storm popping up. Yeah. We just have unless we do, because we just got two in quick succession already. So, yeah. for all we know, there might be a third coming. It is I really 11. gotta find some sheep. Yeah, maybe we should run because it's not like the earliest part of the morning. You know I like to conserve satiety, but uh, yep. oh, hello trees. Yeah, it's okay. Pretty pear trees. You want some oh, pears? Oh, we got pears. Oh. Some pears for the road. Okay. How do you just right click? Do we punch them? Um, well, I... So they're, right, they're not ripe yet. Oh, well, I punched It says ripe in 11.3 days, so oh. maybe we should leave okay, them. let's leave them alone then. <laughs> we must learn the ways of pears. We must. I'm glad that wasn't our pear tree. I got to experiment on another pear tree. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> Keep an eye out for bears. I know they spawn around here. Point. Fortunately, we've got a hell of a line of sight, so... Oh, not where we're going. There also should not be any bears down here. Gary. Ah, hello. We still have to, like, uh, fix this place up. Yep, we do. First, let's fix the translocator. If I may be so bold. Warping space time. Space time subduction right. completed. You want to go first? Uh, does that mean it's ready to use? Um, yeah. Okay. Let's do it. See you on the other side. Hey. Right. Oh wow. All right. Okay. And... Get telefragged. <laughs> okay. We got okay, some let's... let's let's check them out. Let me mark this. Oh god damn it! We're under a lake. Hey, chunk of hematite. What's up? Ooh. What is it? Hmm. This one is translocator is... or B. Hmm. Weird. Oh, let's see what we've got outside. Okay, we got some flax Ooh, twine. Tiny as fuck. Wow, what a slideshow. So if you look at the mini map, you can see, or in the regular map, you can see that we are going to have some trouble getting to the surface. Oh, yeah? Oh, shit. It, oh, man. I, I think this game is almost crashing for me. But yeah, we are underneath water. And that's, oh. um, as, I, as I have experienced already, not fun when trying to dig up from a translocator room. I'm just trying to, like, just get things organized down here. I, you heard me when I said I found some hematite, right? Oh, 
Oh, I, uh, wow. Um, I guess I, I heard it, but it didn't really register. Um, that's cool. Uh, that's uh, so bad. hematite ore in one of the crates, I presume? Yeah, not a ton. Uh, oh, Peter. It... Charlie, saltpeter that's... all over the place. Massive, massive saltpeter. That's very good. Oh, Charlie. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> um, <laughs> You're awfully excited. Yeah, well, we've been, this is one of the things we want. I mean, we can make gunpowder with this shit. When are you going to make gunpowder? Um, pretty soon, from the look of things. <laughs> Ruin chair. Okay, and age wooden planks and ruin chamber. Let's get you out of the way. Let's get you all out of the way. Um, I see it. Okay. For a moment, I thought I had discovered... An invisible um, okay. character. Oh, because I just saw a shadow with nothing to cast it. But it was just weird lighting physics casting a shadow where it shouldn't have been. Oh, so, you just punch this stuff? Uh, oh, I guess you just punch it. Yeah. Okay, we're going to come home with a whole bunch of salt, Peter. There we go. So I won't be driven quite so insane. All right. And this can just go here. All right. So, let's see what you've been up to over here. Yeah, all this salt, Peter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But what's over here? I did here? not know that this was how it worked. It's just like a layer on top of the stone. Snow, almost. Okay. Looks like we've uh, got a drop over here. Yeah, and um, no sign of any way to the surface. Nope. But hey, everyone, I'm going to press M now. Let's see where we are. Oh, I think we could manage it. Yeah, well, the thing to do is to just kind of yeah. dig north, I guess. Make yeah. some stairs north. And we'll, I don't know, maybe we'll come up in the ocean. Maybe um, maybe we're deep to wow, hit ocean before we hit ground. we're nowhere near anything that we're familiar with. We are nowhere about... near anything we're familiar with. Yeah, let's... Oh. I like the look of this place. I want to check it out. I don't know how much of the stuff we should bother gathering before we leave. I, I guess I'll get a full stack of 64. I figure out if we can't get to the surface somehow. Do you have a, do you have a pickaxe? Because I didn't bring one. I've got the remnants of copper pickaxe. It's, it's like one-sixth. You want to see what we can um, get done with that? Yeah, might as well. Um, if you, if you haven't got a copper pickaxe, you can continue the, uh, the harvesting. Yeah. I'll take care of the I'll, saltpeter uh... while you dig around. Okay. Hmm. We'll start digging from the translocator room. Yeah. And make sure to, you're digging in the direction of land there. Oh, yeah. Because I would like I to see north. what's above ground. Probably like five bears, but whatever. We're definitely near some drifters. Yeah. Aren't well, we I almost... might break into a cavern full of them. That'd be pretty fun. Yeah, yeah that's the that's the uh, vintage story rule. You are never more than five meters from a drifter at any time. Yeah, they're like beetles. They're everywhere. Mm -hmm. There are always vast caverns full of horror right next to you. <laughs> okay, how much are I... 36 salt, Peter. Fertilizer, as well as uh, bombs, so... We could use it in a multitude of ways. Um, yeah, yeah. Fertilizers, yeah. What else is required for bombs? Oh, I honestly don't know. That's something I've never even touched. Hmm. I've never been that advanced. Because keep in mind, before we started playing on Sundays like this, I was playing this game alone 99% of the time. Hmm. So and alone, it's a different game. Oh, fuck, I just hit a layer of olivine. Of course... <laughs> Requires bronze to break. Fortunately, so, uh, we got this lots of that. Staircase stops here. Um, yeah. And I am not even going to try and find a different way forward. I understand. I don't blame you. And I'm like you. I don't know how much of this salt Peter will end up needing, but I don't see any harm in getting like all of it. <laughs> hmm. I mean, we have so, so, so many aged crates at home. 
Yeah, yeah, we can definitely handle it. I think I heard your pickaxe break. Um, that would be my axe, actually. Oh. Uh, I just I just harvested this this um, block of aged wood. Oh. And that was the last thing that, that thing will ever harvest. Hmm. Boy, this really is in the middle of nowhere. I guess it's better than spawning into a cavern access place, though. Mm-hmm. I'm kind of curious about some of the things I'm seeing on the surface there. Yeah? Like what? It looks like there's a very tiny island just to the south. And then there are these kind of weird... There's a horizontal yeah. line out in the middle of the water, which I feel like it's probably, like, some ruins. Like yeah, a probably. Wall, Almost maybe? definitely a ruin. I I'm definitely curious. see a lupine meadow and maybe some basalt. Oh, yeah. And hmm. then I'm not sure what that over there is. But yeah, maybe some forest. Could be a lot of things. I marked the salt paper on the map, but I think we're going to get all of it. Yeah, I think <laughs> so I might is... as well remove that marker yeah, in a minute. I, I, I truly do not believe we're going to be leaving any behind. Oh, there's some that's a huge pain in the ass to get to, actually. So maybe... Maybe there will be some left. Mm. Okay, I think unless we want to, like... Foolishness. Yeah. If we... You know what? I don't. I don't want to do foolishness. I, I want to do go home. I don't want to do foolishness either. I want to um, get a bronze pick, and I want to come back here and try to find the surface. Yeah, okay. Let's do that. I'll take the saltpeter with us. Okay. I'm, I'm Watch out for teleporting. I'm on my way. I don't know if that's possible. I don't know if I it is either. I doubt it is, it is. I doubt it is, but it's fun to imagine. What are you looking at? Um, just just taking a look. Yeah, I don't think this goes. Plenty here, but some flints. Yeah. We should wall it off later, just to. Yeah, just for just to keep things tidy. We should we should wall it off. Come back here with some um, some cobble and. Uh, okay. Doors. Well, that was anticlimactic. Sorry, folks. Oh, but, but hey, we've we've got saltpeter. I can see my house from here. Also, you got some hematite ore, right? That is true. We do have some hematite ore. I'm gonna go crush that when I get home. Yeah. So we can get a little bit of iron. I wouldn't say we're actually in the Iron Age, but no, no, we're probably on our way though. And now I really do feel at this point, you know, I'm, I'm fucking asking for it, talking like this. I feel like backsliding now will be very difficult like there was we that yeah. when we slid back into the stone age from the bronze age that was because that house fire i initiated happened at the absolute worst possible time it could have where we were just like uh, just teetering delicately on the edge you know of being yeah. stone age but we were not anymore we were bronze age but we had like two or three max ingots and then they were just gone i still think ingots yeah. burning is bullshit but still yes Okay, and we're back. Like everything, like every other thing that you do with metal in this game requires very specific temperatures. Yes. But ingots can burn. Okay. <laughs> it's mm. fucking stupid. All right. I didn't know I should be using pieces of the house in the kiln. Yeah. Okay, and yeah, I'm going to go put a bunch of the, the, the spoils of looting away. I guess uh, saltpeter belongs in mineral products, but we've got no more room in there. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, things are getting kind of crazy over here. Uh, we do have... It might be time to use more aged double crates. Chest. Oh, oh, double chests. Yeah. Double chests or aged crates. Yeah. Because well, an aged crate of saltpeter or something in the in the attic might work because we don't really have any need for it right now. I guess, yeah. Like, it's not part of our daily routine to use saltpeter on anything. So that's where I'm going to put mine. Yeah. You know what? You're right. Okay. I will put it there as well. Okay. So, um, yeah, we got so many empty crates. I'm just going to put it. And this is, yeah, this one right in front of us is empty right now. So, boom. There it goes. And boom. There it goes. And I have a few granite stones here. That's fine. Um, Spoiling mash. Oh, wow. Okay, and a poor chunk of hematite. Three poor chunks of hematite. Okay. So let me figure out how to get down here. Put the... There we go. Put the... We have building up our gear collection again. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. 
Um, let's go ahead and sorry, that was probably loud. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to crush these hematite. Let's see what we get out of it. Um, okay. I'm going to go uh, try and mine to the surface. Okay. So that is, hmm. We do not have enough for our first iron bar yet. But we will soon. I believe in us. And that is Cassarite, so that's all tin. Okay, and this is Phalarite, so that's zinc. Malachite. Huh. Cool. Sure, we could use some copper. Let's let's do it. Yeah, yeah. If, if, if We've just got loads of places where we could get copper marked on the map. So mm -hmm. um, if it's time for a copper run, I can definitely get plenty. There we go. All right, that's fun. Okay, cool. And actually, you know what I'm going to do? I actually am now just remembering something we have stored, I think. Is it here? No. Oh, wow, but there is a lot of rot in here. I wonder what happened. That's a lot of rot. That's a ton of rot, actually. Do you think maybe something we were planning to eat maybe. just left alone for too long? Maybe. So now Things we've got happen. four barrels going right now. But I'm going to just make a fifth barrel because we need it. Not I think sure that both the, uh, the uh, I think the minerals, the ores, and the uh, vegetable materials all need to be double chests. Yeah. I don't disagree. Now, let me just make another barrel to fill with literal putrescence. Oh, I meant to take more stuff with me. Oh, well. And go ahead and throw that down by the greenhouse. And 38 liters of putrescence, all for you. Okay. So, what's the schedule like? Okay, so, yeah. We're a long way out from having compost, but when we get it, we're going to have tons of... Now, what's my nutrition looking like? Okay, I can eat some fruit. I think I'll go down in the basement and eat some fruit. Hmm. There we go. What's going bad first? Sea level is around 100, right? Generally. I trust you. <laughs> I'm just... Know. You know where you're standing right now? Yeah. I'm at 107, so... Okay, and I'm below... So yeah. But I'm below the ground right now, so... Yeah, but so I've definitely got some mining to do, because I'm at 70. There we go. All right. Oh, but I think, oh, yes, I think I'm actually going to make it to land Good. before I hit the surface. Yeah, I'll come run Maybe. back over. Uh, if you find something interesting and fun, I'll definitely be there. Yeah, yeah. Right now, though, um, I'm just... It'll be long now. Maybe flower. Maybe this is what um, working. bronze pickaxe is badass. <laughs> In fact, I shouldn't be using it. I should be using the copper one for this. Honestly, copper I'm, about one's about to, to die. I'm about to make yet another bronze pickaxe, so it's fine. It's genuinely fine. Uh, might as well. Stop. There we go. Maybe we should stop taking aged crates because, well, the aged crate situation here. Well, maybe we should just make more storage for them because they're great. Yeah, they are. They if are, we haven't got amazing. a room, if we haven't got room for the great stuff, the point, the, the reason is, I mean, the, the solution is to make more room, not to take less great stuff. Yes. Now, what was I doing? What was I doing? All right. Flower. Flower. You don't belong down here, flower. You belong in a crate. Okay. And yeah. Yeah, I think you're good. I think you're good this way. I still need to make like a massive vegetable stew. Okay. Boop. But for now. There we go. Okay. Now, what was I doing? Eight. Pickaxe mold, because why not? Nine. And. Box blade pickaxe. Don't think I'm going to hit water, but I bet I'm going to hit sand. Hmm. Okay. Dirt. 
you know, to stop this in the future, I think what is going to happen now is I'm going to go ahead and just make a buttload more molds. Let's see. Uh, or just two. I guess two is fine. There we go. Should have done this ages ago. There we go. This way I don't always have to be like, oh God, I, I have to think of two things I need to cast. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I do not. There we go. And now that I have an easy way to get all those sticks, and sticks aren't a pain in the butt to get. Hmm. Oh, okay. okay. Just hit the surface. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound like a good way to hit the surface. Oh, I just got dirt dumped on top of me. Oh, Which okay. is, you know, what you expect, because that's what the surface is covered in. Okay, for a minute there, I thought you were drowning. Oh, no, no, no. Things are going okay here. Good. Keep me informed on what you see up there. Um, let's see. Well, first, let me mark this place. Okay. Now. And. There we go. This way. Yeah. Okay, it's getting dark out here. Cool. Okay. Um, and you know, I wonder, if, do I want to make a another mold of anything? Prospecting pick mold. Hmm. Maybe a shovel. Yeah, let's do a shovel. Why not? Why not? Why the fuck not? Yeah, nothing notable about this area yet. Nothing good, just more of the same, really. Um, it looks like uh, I'm just just seeing lots of sand, oh. lots of uh, red top grass. I haven't seen that before. Maybe oh. this is a different biome. That sounds new. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe after I get this I taken can't care of, all that much know, because or... it's dark. Oh well, yeah, that's a that's an issue. Ooh, there are definitely drifters out here, though. Fantastic. That's what everyone wants to hear. Mm. There we go. Let me see if I can check out that possible ruin out in the ocean. Yeah, tell me if you've come across anything interesting because, God, I want to see, like, desert biomes and shit. Yeah, I don't it's even definitely know not I'm... that. This is a green biome. Yeah, if there's anything there's a lot of... more interesting, though, you know? Okay, yeah, this is definitely ruin. Oh, cool. Um, See if there are any pots. Me... There is one right in front of me. Cool. What kind? Um, let's see. Uh, ore. Oh, nice. What kind? And it is black coal. Oh, that's not bad. How many pieces? Uh, 20. Oh, cool. That'll save us a lot of time. Going to get some bony soil, too. Nice. Yeah, grab some bony soil. That's good. Love that stuff. What I was going to do, actually is unless I am mistaken, let me head up to the attic here. In the attic trunk, I believe, now what am I wearing? I am wearing a commoner shirt that's in terrible condition, a commoner trousers that are in terrible condition. What I'm going to actually do now is take our fur coats, our fur gloves, and our fur boots, and I'm going to repair them because now we have so much flax, we can absolutely afford it. Hmm, cool. Let's see. Totally forgot about repairing things. Yep, I'm going to repair the clothes I'm wearing too. Let's see what we got here. So, unless I have forgotten, how you go about doing that is let's just put them on. Or is it here? Or is it here? Okay, put that there, and then. Is it here? Where do I put gloves? Gloves go there. 
Okay, and boots go there. So they're all terrible condition, 0%. Let's go ahead and... Oh, wait. Okay, so we are... I remember I picked up four flax twine from the cave, so... Okay, linen. Now, if it's zero Ow. condition and I apply some linen... Oh, it immediately goes to 50% condition. That's great. Okay, let's keep doing that. One, two, three, four... One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. So, all right. So that's three linen now. And this is at 50%. 100. 54. 100. Okay. Pretty cool. Looks like it'd only be enough to repair a... Hmm. Okay. Well... Okay, 100, 100, okay, and, and, uh, okay. So, uh, I repaired every item of clothing I wore. It took up literally most of our linen, so. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and put these away. Fortunately, we've got a lot of time before winter. Good, good. Yeah, so so flax is still a really nice thing to get more of. Yes, we will. Be, I'm still growing some, so I'll repair good, good. obviously your for ensemble too. Thank you much. But you know, first we need to get it. I'm gonna put yeah. my fur coat. For boots and for gloves, they're at 100%, and they will be ready for next winter now. Fantastic. And I cleared up a ton of space. <laughs> okay, let's see. Yeah, and the plant products, ton of space cleared up now. No big deal. A little bit of compost, huh? Okay. And while I'm here, and I have access to this clay, why not make two skeps? That's what I I'm trying to explore over here, but it's dark and there are actually a lot of drifters out. So uh, we got medium rift activity right now. That we do. And I'm a little bit less interested in fighting them all because we've got all the... Don't make any foolish the, uh, decisions over there. Yeah, we, we don't um, currently have need for any more temporal gears, so... Yeah. But actually, you know. I'm messing with them. Okay. Head into the greenhouse and see how things are going. Yep, pretty much as I thought. More onions. An endless supply of onions here. Ooh, I hear drifters. Hey, sweetie. Bet you wish you could kill me, huh? Bet you wish you could kill me. Yeah. I can't. Okay. Growing, growing. Are you you're really growing? You're not mature yet? That's crazy. Okay. Wow, we're going to have a crazy amount of onions. What is the nutrition on these things even like, though? Wow, pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, hey, found a trader. Oh, nice. What's he got? Uh, commodities. Uh, that could be good. Parchment. Or... Uh, he sells copper. He sells peat. Saltpeter. Bismuthinite. Potash. Huh. Made potash. That's uh, another fertilizer, I believe. Yeah... Oh, he sells sewing kits. Cool. I did not know that was the thing. They are for repairing. Man, drifters as you might expect. Really want to murder me? Look at them. Look at them go. Samoset. That's a cool name. Okay, so you want an end crop? Do you have any? It's rainy and miserable out here. I'm just going to give you a cake crop because I want to. Okay. I'm being very foolish. Okay, so these all want cake crops. These all want cake crops. Got it. Okay. My goodness, look at these drifters. Look at them. The lady can't even fuck around in her own goddamn greenhouse anymore. Hmm. K 
Hay crops it is. Let's head down here. And another ruin. Nice. Any K crops that can take the heat. Yeah, more flax, I guess. We can plant a bunch more flax. And once again, the gigantic flood of onions continues. More onions. More onions for everyone. There we go. Lots of onions. All right. And we have some flaxseed, but that's strictly without, <laughs> without joking. It's for the birds. So we'll leave that for the birds. And what could I eat? Vegetables. I wonder if I could just like boil a shitload of onions. That ought to do the trick, right? Surely that would do the trick. Just boiling a buttload of onions. And don't need to be walking around with this, my god. Okay. Hear you. I hear you. Ow! Oh. Fuck! Oh, you okay? Yeah, uh, I'm getting rained on by drifters and dirt. I'm coming home. Might be a that, good idea. That hurt. Oh, that hurt. Ha <laughs> this time. Fortunately, you've got a lot. Yep. Come oh, on. That was interesting, though. Hmm. There we go. Hey, where are you going? I thought we had something. I'm not being murdered by a bear, as is usually our traditional routine whenever we come through a new translocator. <laughs> I'm just killing from the balcony again. It's a beautiful tradition. When they're not running mm. off like fucking cowards. Yeah, that's a lot. Mm. <laughs> Come here. Come here, fucker. Come here, fucker. That's a bear. Oh, where are you? Far, far away. Okay. Good. I hear you twitch. I see you twitching around over there. No, you yeah, can't. That bear is only. not interested. Okay, so that's two guys. Anybody else? Who wants to party? Who likes to party? I love to fucking party. Where are you? Okay, I think that's the end of them. Fair enough, fair enough. There we go. Oh, more rot. Everybody loves putrescence. Okay. There we are. So much compost. Now. Hello there. Let's see what we can see about you, shall we? Nothing and... Nothing, of course. Okay. Pear tree. Hmm. Don't know if I like that birch log right there. We'll have to do something about that later. Oh, look at all the fucking pumpkins. Hmm. Oh, look at all the fucking pumpkins. Okay. Oh. Might actually be comfortable enough pretty soon to make a pumpkin pie, even. Mm -hmm. I might actually have enough pumpkins where I feel okay with actually cooking with some, is what I'm saying. That'd be cool. Yeah. I have six pumpkins now. Hmm. Yeah. Now. Okay, 10 liters of rot. Don't know where that came from, but don't worry, I'll take care of you. 
And I can go in there. Ooh, white marble. Nice. Where are you looking? Oh, I'm on the other side of the translocator still. I gotta come see that because I haven't seen any of this stuff. I wanna see. I'm going to just because I would love to actually have a sculpture garden with white white marble. I think that'd be hilarious. Uh, well, I could harvest some right now. No, I don't think you could. I could. Do you know how to harvest so that you get blocks and not tiny pieces? Yeah, I do. Um, okay. well, under these circumstances, it would be kind of a pain in the ass. Mm. Hmm. Okay, so how are we doing over here? We doing good? Yeah, no, I can definitely come home with some. Okay. All right. Cool. Okay, now... Let's get some honey. Ah! I'm being stunned. Oh. oh no. Oh, the abuse. Oh, the agony. No. Oh. Don't sting me. Yeah, sting the dummy. Not me. There you go. Sting the dummy. Yes, it's his fault. This is all his fault. Oh. Strange mechanic. I've been savaged. There we go. Now. Honey, 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 honey. Let's see if this will be enough to do anything with, shall we? Six liters, eight liters. So we need at least 1.6. Oh, just short, just short. That's fine, though. Let's go ahead and put this away. Now we have enough for three more candles. And it's light out, light out enough, I think, that I could probably head over to where you are and see how things are going there. Suddenly I'm noticing it seems like there's a lot of light down there. Huh. That is odd. Another is there another entrance to Oh hmm. Okay, so that was a thousand oh. ingots, you're still Beautiful sunrise out here. You gotta gonna, turn on God rays. I'm going to plant some flax and then I'm going to head out to where you are, because I am the curiosity's just killing me at this point. Yeah, it's uh ooh. Hmm. Okay. All right. Yeah, I can leave the unless you're done. No, you're not done at all. I wonder if I could make just a cabbage onion stew and see how that is. I bet that would be real good vegetable nutrition. Mm. Anyway. All right. On my way over. As long as that there's no bears on my side anyway. Let me do my usual shedding of anything. That's not strictly necessary. Yeah. There we go. And. Oh, I got more stuff on me than I thought. There. And yeah, I think that's good. Okay, on my way. Sorry, chickens. Sorry, pigs. Okay. I am running. I know you would you would frown on that, but I am. No. Uh, sometimes it makes sense. This late this early in the day, not so much. <laughs> hmm. Okay. 
Still can't believe there is ice just chilling in the water at this point. That's kind of ridiculous. Yeah, yeah it is. It's like August or something. Some Chicago bullshit right I here. I know, right? Okay, on my way. On my way, on my way, on my way. At the translocator. Mm -hmm. And translocating as we speak. And I'm here. Whoa, ah, ye. Oh, okay. um... Hmm. There's the difficult. Oh, are you seeing like a whole lot of dirt around? Yeah, I teleported chance? into some dirt blocks. Did you telefrag them? I did not telefrag them. I was just waist high in them for a moment. That is definitely to be expected because remember what, what happened when I dug to the surface. Okay. I didn't know you didn't fix it. <laughs> oh, I haven't even been back down there. I'm going to go ahead and dig all this up and I'm going to block this door just for fun. Okay. And oh, wow. Yeah. I have to figure my own way out of here. Huh? Okay. You want me to come dig down to you? Nah, I'm an adult. I can figure it out. Whoop, whoop. Oh, okay. Wow. This is something. Okay. Better than digging up into water. Yeah. Beats dying. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, there's just like... Wow. Wowie. Okay, well... <laughs> I guess I'll be there soon. No. Hmm. Okay, I'm getting okay, some marble I blocks for you here. I think I might be approaching the surface now. Yeah, I'm at the olivine now. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, here we are. I'm on my way up. Get my falks out, maybe. Oh, slate. Hey, slate. Yeah, I'm grabbing slate, too. Yeah, grab. A, anyway. Oh, there's a bunny that got stuck down here. Hi, sweetie. You want to come live in my larder? I need to slate. I think you do, buddy. Ah. ah, almost. Almost, almost. Damn. Okay, here's sandstone. Okay. So here we are, huh? Mm hmm Okay. Well, I mean, I've seen worse. All right, you mean the, uh, the general vicinity? Yeah, I mean, it doesn't make me want to die. It's a nice looking place. Um, the only new resource I've found here so far is uh, this marble, unless you want to count, like, um, red grass or whatever it's called. Yeah. I, uh, I'm going to try and find the... Here we are. Let me just go ahead and... Mark that on my map here. Yeah, and definitely mark entrance. Translocator for entrance. There we go. Red, swirl, save. There we go. Hmm. Yeah, uh, I guess I could look around a little. Hello there, oh. your flax. Never say no to some more string. Just Axis don't, always. gotta make sure I don't make the same mistake I always make in situations like this. Get greedy mm, and that weird. Be? Oh, yeah, yeah. Some grass. Oh, red currants. Hello. Yeah, uh, Native copper. Oh, yeah. You were saying we needed some. Yep.
Make sure. There we go. All right. Oh, a shell. Cool. I want it. Huh. Yeah, I mean, it's not a bad place. Huh. It's just, you know, I would like to see another biome at some point. Yeah, I know. I'm not, like, bummed, but it's not what I was hoping for. Mm. Well, I'm happy that we've got marble. Yeah. Walking through that loop. And also saltpeter. The saltpeter is still the big find here. Yeah. Walking through that lupine area that we saw before. Mature spelts. I wouldn't kick it out of bed. So blasting powder is made from saltpeter, sulfur, and black coal. So we need to find We've never sulfur. found sulfur. Yeah. God, we have definitely reached a different age because I am just ignoring flint now. I, like, couldn't care less. Oh, I don't ignore it. Oh, I ignore it all up and down. We have so much... Hi, bunny! We have so much at home, you know? Yeah, but, you know, I always eat some on me. There we go. Now. Bunny wants to come live with us in the basement. <laughs> okay. That's something I won't have a hard time saying no to. Protein. Okay. Is this more? Oh, no, it's rye. Fabulous. I'll take that. Hmm. Oh, blue clay. I mean, I think we have a ton of blue clay at home, though. Like an mm. actual fucking ton. Yeah, I... Well, no. Like, it's always... It's the sort of thing you get in huge amounts, but then you also use up yeah. and then forget. But I'm of. pretty sure last time I was looking for space to store stuff, I found a gigantic pile of it in the in the attic. And oh, well, in that case. Yeah. Oh, I hear a fucking portal. Where are you? Mm -hmm. Hear a portal. Heard you. I heard you. There you are. Okay. Fox trying to swim. Doesn't seem very smart, but, you know, live your life, I guess. Mm. Nothing blowing me away very much just yet. Um, do you know how to make parchment crates? Um, uh, I could probably figure it out. I mean, if you can just ask the guide, I'm sure. Yeah, no, I'm just wondering off offhand, do you think that's something worth buying from the trader? Um... I mean, I know it's pretty labor-intensive, but I also don't think it necessarily has a ton of actually, uses oh, for us. Well, it labels crates. Oh, it labels crates. Oh, okay. And we use, we've got a shit ton of, of crates, and we use them for storage, you know, more and more. But we can put signs uh, on crates. And like, that's we, how we did all this, the crate labels at home. Um, no, no uh, you're talking about chests. Oh, we can't... Oh, okay. We have not labeled any crates. I okay. don't know if you can do that. Okay. And also, I think the... Um, I think parchment's automatic. Okay. So, I think it might be worth getting some parchments. Okay. And uh, well, we can, I we actually have the don't see a recipe spare. for it, which we is very annoying. We have the to spare, so... Maybe we should buy parchment from the commodities see what we trader. Got here. All right, so I'm I'm taking a hell of a little walk here. Not sure this is the smartest thing I've ever done, but I'm not really hmm. seeing much. I mean, it could be worse. It could be full of like horrible animals. But we're not getting murdered by anything this time. Yeah, exactly. Don't know what I'm complaining about. I could be getting murdered right now. <laughs> I saw one bear, so the place is not free of dangerous animals. Yeah, I'm keeping to the lowlands, kind of, where it's very obvious from very far away if there's anything I need to worry about. I'm steering clear yeah. of forests right now. Just trying to see if there's anything worth looking at around here. Kind of got my, you know, my heart set on maybe some terra preta would be nice. 
Ooh, yeah. But I, I need to get good at spotting that because I could walk right past it. Yeah. But case, I don't know. I, I've found it before, I think, but I'm not good at spotting it. Yeah. Oh, no, that's just some more slate. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I found sure. some slate. I really like the idea of slate. I'm going to come back here specifically for the slate because I want to change out our roof for a slate roof. Okay, I'm getting lots, lots, well, I'm getting a few slate blocks along with the um, yeah. marble blocks. If you want to get slate stones, I think that's how we make it. Oh, okay, yeah. Um. yeah. There's not a lot I have not already. Oh, hello, what's that up there? Right as I was about to say, this place sucks! What is that up there? Sand. I'm going to get these turnips. See if I can't get some Ah, sand. slanted slate roofing. Yeah. Oh yeah, slate stones are indeed the thing. Yeah. So I will make sure to bring home lots of slate stones. Yes, please do. Okay, so what have we got here? Are you some, uh... Oh, you're flint. You got my heart. I'm all going and you're flint. I don't care about you. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, nothing yet, nothing yet. Mine not blown. More flint. Fish. Some mature rye. Grab some. I'm here. Hmm. Maybe some blackberries. Or other black currants. I'm here, so. Oh, fuck you. Fucking portal just spawned right in, right in front of me. Uh -oh. Fuck you, too. I'm gonna swim away. I'm going to Oh, go yeah, we're the... still oh. seeing medium activity right now, huh? Yeah. Let's see what we got. Okay, so, you know, I've gotten a few things here. Nothing to write home about. Some rabbit meat. Some, some thread. A few berries, a little bit of grain, two turnips, a nice shell. It's fine, you know. It's better than getting yeah. nothing. Well, what's my health looking like? Hmm. Really, so far, I think that the best thing that we've gotten out of this is the saltpeter. From yeah, the, the saltpeter is kind of the winner so far. It's the one real Which is wild, because we don't like need might, much saltpeter. Yeah. <laughs> I love the 1890 subway construction simulator. Thank you, Abyss. Just dying under landslides constantly. Mm. Mm. Not being blown away by anything on the far end of this, I have to say, though. Keeping an eye out for things like terra preta and... Excuse me, terra preta and fruit trees. But the other thing that we could do is prospect... I suppose we could. That might be worth taking a look at. But at the moment, I'm still trying to find a better source of hematite than um, uh -huh. than like a high chunk. If I could get very high or ultra high, then it's definitely time to start mining. Is that a fruit tree? You look kind of like a fruit tree. Hmm. No, you're birch. Okay. Never mind. Dreams dashed. Hopes shattered. Oh, sad. Yeah, oh, the sad. Yeah, is that? No, that's not anything. Okay. Just looking around. No horrible animals, but also nothing that's making me go, oh, thank God, we found this translocator. Hmm. Okay, well, I've got a stupid number of marble blocks, I think, uh... I think it's quite enough. I'm, I'm using up my pick here. Okay. And I want to come check out the surface a little bit. How pretty. Yeah, I want more slate stones than anything, though. Just keep that in mind. Oh, got loads of slate, yeah. Good, good, good. Okay. Yeah, there's just a... Yeah. I mean, I'm seeing a few, like, mildly interesting things, but nothing we don't have back home. Gravel, yeah. horsetail, well, pine trees, loose flint. Like, no offense, but who cares, right? Yeah, let's uh, keep looking a little more. Yeah, 
Mm -hmm. Hope something interesting pops up. I'm not running around like a uh, chicken with my head cut off, though, because that's how you run into bears and shit. So I'm just kind of yep, definitely looking around, walking slowly. It's worth just grabbing the kinds of things that you only ever see in new territory, like this mm -hmm. growing rye right here. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's what I like to do. I like to do a sweep and just get all the growing vegetables and grains and stuff. Check out any ruins, that kind of thing. Exactly. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I mean, I won't leave these turnips. Huh? Oh, what are you? Are you a fruit? No, you're a birch. Birch, disappointing me since since forever. I, you don't sound like you're finding anything interesting either. Um, uh, more ruins. Oh, well, that's not bad. Oh, I, I found some ruins new. too. This one looks like a little castle. It does seem a little bit like maybe there are more ruins here than usual. I found one that looks like a little castle. Okay. Hmm. Let's see what we got. Yeah, this would be a good place to come to get lots and lots of granite cobble. Okay, so I pick something up. What I pick up? I know you didn't just give me a fucking flint knife. What garbage. What absolute garbage. You got some nerve, dude. Oh. That's good, though. Oh, hey. Cracked vessel farming. What you got for me? Oh, garbage. Wow, it's just like endless parade of garbage with you. Well. I think I am going to eat these red currants. So I have room to carry back this bony soil. Oh, you know what you ought to do now? What? Stuff the house. But you keep berating yourself over. Yeah, I should take care of that. But first, bony soil. Oh yeah, grab all the bony soil. I don't even care. I hurt myself. Ooh, another ruin. Nice. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to dump something to carry whatever I find. I know that I feeling. Ooh, so many sneaky little holes. Okay, let's see. Okay, that's the end of it. And we have a... Another ore vessel. That's pretty good. Hopefully. Oh, uh, yeah, it's perfect because it's full of more black coal. Nice. Which stacks with all the black coal I've already got. Good. Yeah, I'm going to looking around uh, this ruin. I found this little mini castle. Not oh, really... and there's also, ooh, magnetite. More iron. Good. Okay, so this is just nothing, right? This is just nothing. I could come back when I have my tin bronze shovel, but I don't think I will. I think this is probably nothing. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the damage noise is interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, where am I? Oh, I suppose I could go that way. Bony soil here. Yeah, I found two. Oh, and here's another shell. How nice. Let's see. What's going? Because something's going. Hmm. I suppose I can eat these five black currants. did that in tandem because we're just like looking around like trying to find the upside of a fairly boring other end of a translocator i like that it's got ruins yeah the ruins are nice um, i suppose also a lot of holes to fall into yeah. um i don't remember to mark these things a lot of butterflies too 
Yeah. Uh, cranberry. And these are cranberries. Pick them up. There. Silly. Okay. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's fine. It's all fine. It's fine. I'm pretty content to go home and take care of some building chores now, I think. Yeah, I think that's a good idea, because you did intend to do that Yeah, this I time. did. I just got excited because I was hoping there might be something fun on the end of this. I'm going to keep looking around a little bit here because go I'm not it. starving yet. Yeah, I'm. I'm it's kind my of got. Usual routine. I got that sort of double motivation because I'm. I'm packed to the brim right now. So. Yeah. Yeah, and for that matter, I. I am in the same situation. Yeah. I I'm having to throw road. things away to pick new things up. So I think it's time to. Uh, it's definitely time to go. To take the haul home. Oh, hey there, sheep, and baby sheep. Oh, and more turnips. I got room for that. Who would say no to turnips? Ooh, another trader. And some more copper bits. Alright. Okay. And there, we're never gonna run out of copper, at least hopefully. Oh, I found something. What'd you find? Oh. What? What? Um, discovered tapestry lore, part five of nineteen. Where are you? This I thought it was gonna be a translocator room, but it's something else. It's a different kind of. Where are oh, you? One more. There, there's a tapestry. Um, okay, None well, of I'm these gonna, are answering well, my questions. I am. Uh, do you want the numbers? What do you want? I'm I far want to the to know north. Where you though. are. I'm on the other side of Translocator 4, far to the north. Far to the north? Yeah. I went a little ways north. Anyway, anyway, I'm going to read the uh, the tapestry lore. Okay. Five. Rot. It left nothing behind. Not harvest, not livestock, not arbor nor stream, not child nor mother. When it came, you could only run and pray you did not see it again. And I believe I can take this tapestry off the wall and take it home. Do it! It, all it does not all stack. I have to throw stuff away to take it. Oh, but well, fuck these flints. Yeah, seriously. And, we, um, have, we have literally four stacks of flint at home, so you don't need flint. And also this cobble, because it's only two pieces. Ah! Fucking drifter! Hmm. All right, I am marking this. I'm coming back here later. Um, star. Little fucker. Thanks for the twine, asshole. Okay, I'm coming home now because I'm cool. literally having to drop stuff. Yeah, um, I, I had to drop uh, a bunch And there's of more stuff. stuff to gather here, too. Oh, I'm actually, ooh, I'm actually going to put an oil lamp on the other end of this because a drift. I just was greeted by a drifter down here, so. Hmm. Good idea. Put an oil lamp up here. All right. And heading home. Okay. Cool. Home again. Home again. I want to see that tapestry in our ugly house. I need to fix that fucking house. It is a three by one tapestry, so that sounds. If good. you want to make some space for it, we'll be able to put it uh, cool. somewhere. Okay, this is an artisan trader. Uh huh. Um. Hmm. Arhad. Okay. Oh, he sells more tapestries nice. and storage vessels. Planters. Oh, fancy stuff from the look of it. Cool. Perhaps at some point. Yeah, but he would buy rough peridots, rough diamonds, rough emeralds. What quality level will he buy of those? Rough. No, I mean, it should say like quality low, quality high. Oh, potential high, potential medium. Okay, so we only potential have low. low. 
Oh, oh, we it will buy rough Peridots with low potential. It'll also buy charcoal and peat. Good. And blue clay, even. But, you know, he needs a whole stack before he'll mm -hmm. pay one gear. All right. I'll come back for you later, buddy. Let's get all this junk out of my inventory. Wooden trunk. New okay, well, this is something to check out later. Um, it would be a great time to run home after I check out one more object that I'm seeing. Okay, it's nothing. All right, then I'm coming home. All right. And chicken. Yeah, let's put the chicken away. No, let's put the chicken away. Okay. And we Pardon have me. perishable. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and put you in with the rest of the turnips. And is that all I got? No, we got some cranberries. So let's go ahead and put you in with cranberries. So you stay fresher a little longer. There we go. And I have some. Yep, okay. That's coming long and spelt green, rye grain. It would be a fun giant project for this game when you're in like a post scarcity kind of situation. What? Nazca lines. Yeah, that would be. Because you can, uh, in the new update, they do have gliders. Oh, I didn't even think of that. I'm just going to really do this because cool. I'm impatient. I want to see. It's time for my favorite. Pointless activity. Well, not totally pointless. Let's sift. I'm sifting. Sifting is one of those things they put in this game because, like, people are always like, what if I just search low and high? I search my fucking balls off. What if I just, like, run myself into the ground searching and I don't find copper? Mm -hmm. And that's kind Which of Which has sifting. been our experience. And if we had realized how viable sifting was, mm -hmm. we would have done that. But sifting the bony soil is different from sifting sand or gravel. Because yes. when you sift the bony soil, well, I don't know if you just saw, but an emerald just popped into my inventory. You can get all kinds of fun archaeological things when we sift bony soil. You also soil. always find something from bony soil. Yeah. Like, there is never a bad sift. Yeah, it's always it's pretty something. pretty great. Okay, so that's an arrowhead. I think it's a flint arrowhead. So I'm just going to get these because, like, I can't wait. I have to know what's in these. A lot of bones. I so, so understand. Far. A lot of bones. A lot of bones. Oh, a basket. Huh. A basket came out of bony soil. Hmm. That's so weird. Like, a, you know, like a storage basket like you make when you first oh. spawn into the world. That's that's good. Those are, I mean, a floor basket or a hand basket? Oh, a hand basket. Oh, that's less useful. Yeah, I'm going to cut it up with my knife when, when I get finished here. Can you recycle them into reeds or something? You can. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so it's free reeds, you know? Mm hmm Yeah, I found a copper arrowhead for you. Always good. Oh, and a Much nugget of silver. Good. Oh, two nuggets of silver. Oh. I'd love oh, to find man. a book or something, though. I am seeing more interesting ruin-like stuff on the map and resisting the urge to go running off after oh. it because it's getting dark. Not to I mix business with pleasure, but Jay Brooks, did you see the things that I showed you? I showed you things. I created images um, and I did send them to you. I hope you saw them. Um, ooh, this is a big ruin. Vagaries. I actually don't even know what you're talking about. That's okay. That's fine. And okay. So yeah. Um, out of that we got a flint arrowhead, a copper arrowhead. That's kind of like matte territory. Um we got a bunch of bones. We got a low potential rough emerald, and we have, most bizarrely at all, a hand basket, which I'm gonna cut up right now. We get five reeds out of. Very strange. Okay. Alright. And we got yeah, okay, that's fine definitely think this area has a higher occurrence of ruins. Mm, definitely. Animal products. There you go. 
And what else have we got? Okay, yeah. A lot of twine now. Lots of twine. And but it's a relief when the rain stops. Ores. Silver. Copper. And yeah, I think that's it. And... Can I put anything in here? No. Wow. I just got to make some new display cases. That's simply all there is to it. Absolutely do. Yeah. I'm going to do that right now. I don't if even you know. Need, if you need more quartz, I can definitely get that. Hold on. Display case. Wish we could hang it on a wall. Okay. So I just need yeah. a square of glass and two boards. It's it's the simplest fucking thing in the world. Square of glass and two boards. Um, Where are those boards? Okay. Take that. And I know I have some glass around here somewhere. Like, you cannot fool me. I know it. There's no fooling me. I haven't seen any in a while, so I'm not sure. There it is. Okay. So, um, wow, a ton of rotten stuff in here still. Let's just get that out of here. And two boards. Okay. Display case. Perfect. Now, where will the display case go? I wish I could, like, put it on a wall or something like that. No. It's got to have a table. That's fine. Okay. Uh, where's the minerals? I have yet another emerald that no one will care about. We have low quality peridot. We have low quality emerald. We have some olivine. And seriously, we have literally nearly four I'm stacks starving. of flint. Don't bring home any more fucking flint. <laughs> okay. And it's like the longer... The higher we get up in, like, the technology chain, the less likely we are to ever, ever need that again, so. Oh, I feel like you always need to make the occasional uh, flint knife out in the wild. Let me just go ahead and put this away. Or rather, put this back where it belongs, so it's there when we need it. And display cases, display cases. I, let's make a table. That's what we need to do. Um, take the bad copper saw first. Take the ugly birch first. Twelve boards. That'll do it. Table. Okay. Get back in there. No one likes you, birch. Uh, hmm. I suppose we can stick it here. And where's my display? There it is. Stick it here. And let's get some shells. I have one shell here, and anything. I want something nice. Uh, well, that's the same shape as. Ah, here we go. Uh oh. Uh. -huh. Oh no, I'm so hungry. <laughs> I see your name tag bopping along in the window. Welcome home. Mm. Yeah, uh, hello. Oh, yeah. Pardon me, chickens. Uh, the chicken's okay, they did not panic as I went past. Sea foam. And. Uh, okay. I guess I'll take the scallop because it's different. I hear you dying over there. Food. God. Here, here's some. Here, Fair. I threw it on you. Thank you. I'm going to make a That's cabbage and onion stew now because I think we both need vegetable satiety. A Let's see. A grain even more. Take all the cabbages. Take a bunch of onions. This ought to do wonders. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to put the marble and slate blocks in the unlabeled chest. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna put seeds where the seeds go up oh, i've got a stupid number of um slate stones now fantastic uh, i'm not sure where those should go because wow. we're really running out of just regular stone storage mm -hmm. oh i've got coal have we got a good place for coal? yeah go check the little tiny basket that is by the bloomery yeah that's right now excellent let's see six six Hefty stew. Perfect. Okay. I hear you, you little shit. 
Is this door closed? Yes, it is. Okay. I know, I know. Oh. It's fine. I'm going to go ahead and put that there. Are you hungry? I'm okay. Here, 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 oh. here. Come here. Take. Take food. Okay. I had an extra bowl on me that I forgot about. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Good job. Yeah. There we go. Starving the whole way home. Okay. And now, with this ready to go, we can finish up my next smelts because I'm going to make a few things over here. Wow, I love it. Look at that coal supply. Fantastic. There we go. So I've got 11 nuggets of magnetite. Cool. So we can get some iron out of that. Oh, wow. What is that? That's a poor chunk of sphalerite. Okay. And that's hematite. More sphalerite in there. Uh, 20 pieces will smelt into an iron bloom. Oh, hey, where can I put this tapestry? Oh, give it to me. Okay. Um, it is in three pieces. Okay. Oh, wow. Aren't you healthy? My goodness. Let's figure this out, shall we? All right, so this is Rot Tapestry. S center third, left third, right third. Okay. Okay. So, where have we got... Huh. How about... No, that's not very good. It's okay. sifting time. A tapestry. Right, a little sifting time. How about we put it over Matthew's bed since Matthew found it? Oh, let's go around. Yay, the rock tapestry. Right where Matt. Ooh, discovered Ooh. tapestry lore. Part 5 of 19. Hit J to open your journal. I forgot that everyone gets to hear that. Yeah. Yep, there's what you just read out. Mm -hmm. Cool. Look at that. You can kind of see like a person bent over and like with their head in their hands. I still have to go back and get other stuff from that same ruin. Cool. Oh, and we have our cabbage and onion stew. It's hefty. Yum, yum. Huh. Look at that. Mm, green slop. Yum. Let's eat it. Love it. And that'll do my vegetables. There we go. Look at that. Perfect. But the question now is, let's go ahead and take you off the heat because it's time, once again, to make some bronze. There we go. That's it. 1,000 units of tin bronze. And what we will do is we will pour... Yeah, so how many... Uh, oh, yeah. Okay, I will definitely pour eight ingots, another pickaxe, and a shovel. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Okay. And peat. We should have plenty of peat. Yep. Two peat. And then while I'm waiting, I think I'll grab some of that coal. Hey, find anything fun while you're sifting? Just the usual kind of stuff. Oh my god, what is the rift activity like? It's low, but I hear them just going to town out there. Um, Ooh, look at that. More pumpkins. Yeah, I wonder if the corner of the building is just, like, due to geometry, like, the place they get stuck. Mm -hmm. Worth going out there and just cutting them down. Hmm. How we doing? Okay. Put the peat in, then. Oh, shit. <laughs> Open the door. One came in. And there were two. I was I was expecting uh, one. I wasn't expecting two. Ooh, he smacked me. Okay, I'm helping. Oh, they're hitting each other. Really? They do that? Mm-hmm. Nice. Oh, sorry. 
That's okay. Okay, I'll leave you to it. They were annoying. This problem me. is solved. Uh, rusty gear and flax from the same one. Nice. How often do you see one with two drops? Not very. Okay, that's I've broken my my knife. I don't suppose you have a, a copper knife in here. Uh, I have several knives. Bronze I think even. I can give you. There should be one that's over here. Oh, oh I don't see one. Um, I do have an extra knife though here. Oh, thank you. And by the way, stop, stop. Come back. That's for you, and that's for you. Oh, were those arrowheads? Yep. Thank you. And I'm gonna put the rest Very of these cabbages job. and onions away. What's that? Um. Now there is definitely a portal near us. Hmm. I think I'll check on this. How are things going over here? On your way. Fair enough. I keep forgetting you gave me all those poultices. I think I'll use a few. Yeah, and there's a pile more in the um, uh, one of the three aged crates at the top of the stairs up to the bedroom. Okay. I think that will go stare at the chicken a little bit. There's so much fewer of you now. So many fewer of you. Hey, kids. Huh. Are there chicks? That's interesting. Uh, I could have sworn. Huh. Kind of weird. What's I, going on with the chickens? I, I thought some hens, some chicks would have hatched by now, but I'm not seeing any. Hmm. I was kind of worried about the chickens because I ran right past them and didn't hear the usual frenzied squawking. No, they're there. But as long as there are chickens in there, I'm they're not there. So worried. I came in and I thinned them out, so they're all Gen Two. Hmm. But, hmm. It's weird. The Gen 2 ones still are afraid of us, right? Yes, they're still... It's only like, a Gen 10 They won't they start, like, Gen running... Two. Yeah, it's like, they're not going to be super cool about everything until, like, Gen 3, Gen 4 or something. And then they'll oh, really? be completely oh, placid no matter what you do in front of them around Gen 10. Oh, interesting. I'm going to go put some more food in their trays. Whoop! Okay. So you're just like, okay. So there you go. Leave you to that. And hmm. okay. There you go. Knock yourselves out, ladies. I found a diamond. Yeah, not bad. The fact that you find rough gems with a potential rating yeah. really tells me that there actually has to be a gem cutting update in the future. Yeah, there's gonna be one for sure. Okay. Alright, so we've got just 22 liters of rot we don't have room for to do anything with. So I'm just gonna save that. I'll, I'll leave the rot in. Let's just assume it rotted down from a plant. I'll leave it in plant products. Okay, important question. Does rot go bad? No, it does not. Oh, cool. I understand where that sort of question is coming from. It does not go well, bad. There's a certain nature to this game. Yeah, sometimes this game does things that are mildly to moderately inexplicable, so I understand the motivation behind asking that. There we go. And, yeah, okay. And, there we go. And my knife, which can go here. Okay. Hello, how's it going? So I'm gonna go shovel, eight ingots, fresh pickaxe. 
But I love that this thing has full-on Minecraft-style inventory handling. Yeah. All the commands are the same. Okay, so that's Very Valorite, convenient. and that is Morse Valorite. Huh. Catharite, Galena, Magnetite. Morse Valorite. And a lot of silver. Huh, okay. Wow, that's a lot of bismuth. And before I use the nice bronze knife, let's just keep the crap knife out and use that up. And come on. Come on. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hey, did you ever give me all those slate uh, chunks? Oh, no, I put the slate chunks in... Um... This basket here next to the clay oven. Oh, okay. The floor basket over here. A little pile. All right, let's do this. God. More bronze than we actually know what to do with. Never in my wildest dreams. Nice. You said we're getting low on copper, though. Yeah, we are, because we're making so much bronze. Yeah, okay, well that's uh, something that we can resolve. But before I do anything like that, I do want to get more stuff from that ruin. Um, before I do that, I need some food. Yeah, there's there some food, cabbage. There's food ready to go in the basement, right? There's food ready to go in the basement. You can take a pie with you. You can take some bread with you. You can also take a bowl of cabbage stew with you. We have cabbage stew up here. Oh, if there's, if there's fresh cabbage stew, I should take Yes, that. there is fresh cabbage stew. Oh, long as okay. Stuff. And that is the next load of tin bronze. Just ready to go. And I had to, I have no other place to put the display case but here. So. Okay. What if uh, I could so put a pie in there? Anyway. Back through Translocator 4. Good luck. It's uh, 5 in the morning, so it's a great time to do this. <laughs> yeah, it actually is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get some pine and figure some shit out, shall we? 20, 222? Good lord, what was I even doing gathering pine? Okay. Because I want to make a chicken coop. I've been meaning to do that for a thousand years. It's a thing I want to do. Mm. Bam. There we go. Pine is just fine for firewood and uh, also for when you want to get rid of a pine tree. <laughs> Five. There we go. Alright. Uh, Honestly, I have really no awareness of what the different kinds of wood look like hmm. yeah hey, so... i have a preference for pine because i'd like a united appearance between all of yeah. our buildings oh oh pine is the wood that we actually do use yes birch is the okay. wood i hate yeah and oak of course we need for uh cannons yes Just harvested two more pumpkins. Pretty happy about that. Oh, we should put a lamp down here. So that's eight pumpkins. Nice. Never had that many ever. Now. So things are finally going well with pumpkins then. Finally, huh? yes. It was a bit of process. It definitely was. Oh, right, 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 you. Oops. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Um... So when you first started up tonight's session, mm -hmm. um, you first accidentally started up Vintage Story 1.18. Yes. New version. And tried to open this world to save. Yes. And it did not open, right? Yes. So does that mean that we cannot switch to 1.18 and keep the same world at all? I'm going to tell I've, you right now, I have no idea what it means. I had some idea that we could do that, but um, I'm not sure if I got it from any kind of particular source or if it was just an assumption. I don't know. I truly do not. No. So, I don't know, maybe there's like a Ooh. update program or something we could run on it. I don't know, but uh, maybe something... That we need to look into because I've been hoping that we could do that. Mm -hmm. 
But if we can't, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, that's something to consider. More native copper. That's good. Yeah. Um, I might I might dig around a little here. Actually, go it's for it. Running low. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try a few things. I think. Let's see. Yeah, why not? Okay. Probably be close to the surface if there's anything. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Let's experiment a little bit more. Put these bones away. Having my little deep think while I try and figure out a chicken coop of all things. Hmm. Let's see. I have to keep that on me. Let's go and get that again. Okay, 16. All right, that'll do. Let's try that. And actually, while I'm here, do we have any? We do. We do. We have some rough hewn fence. Let's just let's just see how this looks. Because I'm I'm trying to just sort of do this on the fly here. But I want it to be something I can bear to behold, you know? Hmm. Yeah. We can always make changes, but it's more hassle to make changes than it is to do it right in the first place. Exactly. Think all you gotta think. Hmm. There we go. Now, fence. Huh? Hmm. Don't yell at me. I don't know what I'm doing. Believe in you. <laughs> I think I'll try something different. Okay. I think what I will do... I think what I will do... Sorry to be freaking you out, chickens. I'm trying something here. So as it turns out, we are not going to be wanting more copper anymore. Oh, um, yeah? That's uh, finding a lot of copper. Fantastic. Good old load of copper. 44 chunks. Nice. It's poor, but, you know, it's just oh, keep copper's us going. Copper. Until, yeah. yeah. That'll keep us going, hopefully, until the Iron Age. Yeah, that, yeah, considering we are slowly but surely accumulating iron over here. Then, what if one were to do that? Oop. Hmm. Stop. Okay. Okay. Oh, I think I see a tower. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. 
Okay. I'm gonna... Yeah, that's a serious ruin. I'm gonna come back to that. I'm just gonna check on things over here. How are we doing? Yeah, I figured you'd be mature by now. Everybody else kind of doing their thing? Okay. So many oh. ruins. Okay. Growing, growing, growing. Growing. Oh, you look. Oh, you're growing. Okay, so you're not mature yet. Got it. And pear tree has not decided whether it wants to live or die yet either. Okay. But this is so K crop, sure. P crop, P crop. P crop, K crop. Okay, and oh, you're mature. Yep, P crop, K crop, sure. Alright, and okay. Alright, looking good. Maybe some spelt. Oh, I got some rice grain. Oh, wow. Oh, wait. Not nope, seed. No, no rice seeds. Oh. No. Oh, well. Yeah. Got excited. Yeah. Okay. You make sushi in this game? You cannot, amazingly enough. Oh, maybe I'm thinking of a mod. You are definitely thinking of a mod, because I'm thinking of that same mod right now. I would love that mod. Oh. So, P crops and K crops. Oh, you're an end crop. Um... Do we have anything else that's a K crop? Not really. Uh oh, this fish is 1% spoiled. Better cook it. Two chicken. You know what? With four chicken. And I wonder if I could make fish and eggs. Let's see how that goes. Let's go ahead and put that here. Uh oh. Gotta empty out that pot before we can cook in it. Hmm. Okay, finally. Let's see what we can do. Um, so, fish, chicken. Okay, fish poultry, hearty fish poultry stew with eggs, with boiled eggs. That's gonna be a weird mm. one. Fish poultry stew with boiled eggs, two servings. Let's oh. do it. Lead ore bits on the surface. Oh, here. absolutely, mark that. I want to make some more leaded windows. There we go. Now, what I came in here for real to do is let me just get these fellas out. Might mine that on the way back. Put them in the corner. Look at that. Nice little pile. And let's go ahead. I will just carry this one around. We are in a point now where I think it's safe to carry around a bronze pickaxe. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I have to put a bunch of stuff away now. That and that and the eggs. Just get all these where they need to go before I. Okay. Okay. You can stay there. You can stay there. Eggs. Feathers and a saw. Okay. 
Now, I'm just going to stay here. And we can put everything back where it needs to go. There we are. Look at that. Look at that weirdness. The fish doesn't spawn, so it's just chicken and eggs. It's like an Oyakodon. Hmm. Now, but I came here for a reason. Okay, so yeah, grain. Wow, I need to eat some grain. We have tons of food, but we need to eat, I need to eat more grain. Okay, um, so let me go. I'm kind of going for a design thing here. Rough hey, is it raining where you're at? Um, I don't think so. Two logs. Oh, two interesting. Stars. So weather is regional. Let me see. Nope, no rain. That's interesting. How are we doing? Okay. Two logs, two sticks. Mm, two sticks. Or is it up here? Or is it down here? Really? Huh. Okay, I, I clearly instantly forgot. Hold on. Okay. Oh, oh. Axe. Two sticks in a row. Okay, got you. Okay. Let's try that. Let's see what we can see here. Okay. I don't think you can get out this way. But maybe you can. I'll have to address that later. Oh, I just hear like gravel and sand collapsing all around me. Hmm. I almost wonder if it's the rain doing it. I'm not seeing like animals in this part. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Oop, that is not what I meant to do. Oh my god. Knock it oh off. Oh god, I'm about to die a nutty putty death. I'm just going way too deep here. Oh. Oh? And I found something. What'd you find? It's, uh, it's just... Oh, I thought it was going to be a translocator room, but it's just a little cobble room that's full of cobwebs. Huh. I've never seen spider webs in this game before, but... Me neither, actually. Um, there's a library... Oh! <gasps> What? Record player. Oh, cool. Oh, dude. Okay, wow. Oh, wow. On oh, my gear is spinning. This place is cursed as fuck. <laughs> Bring it home. We have so many records. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm also seeing uh, library shelves, books. Cool. Okay, so. Hmm. Oh, boy. Okay. Um, do you har do I harvest this with a, with a pickaxe, you suppose? Sure. Or maybe just punch it. Shit. Yeah, it's gonna pop with a punch. Yeah, there we go. A record player. And a book. Nice. Gonna read a book. Okay, we have Dimitri's Notes, part one of five. I'm going insane while this is happening, by the way. <laughs> okay. These are the findings of Dimitri Arvo regarding the natural philosophies of Cata Hill University. I cannot seem to make sense of it myself. It irks me terribly. Lord Chamberlain Fulce will be here within the month. No doubt he will carry with him the end of my erudition if I fail to provide him his answers. My only consolation here is that the other scholars have failed more bitterly than I. 
One of them, the older, goutish fellow, caught fire to his laboratory trying to incinerate the black filth. Okay, oh. interesting. As for me, I have been loath to even approach it. This excitement, whatever it may be, I catch myself on the edge of prudence whenever I investigate it. It seems to spread regardless of condition. No procedure I have tried can halt it. I vacillate between fury and flight. How should I kill it? With what can I do to st what can I do to stop this? And all of the same, what can I do? Can it be stopped? What dreadful scourge is this? But enough of this. The dark substance haunts my thoughts, but I will not suffer its rule. The Lord Chamberlain will be here soon. And I intend to have results. Oh my. Okay. Wow. So that's that's a data point. It sure is. Um. Need wooden tables here. Nice. If you can get those home, get them home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. oh, I can pick up the... Um, that's interesting. Apparently I can pick up the cobwebs. I don't know if you want these for anything. Hmm... I could figure something out of it. Oh. Hmm. My inventory is filling up way too fast here. I've also got to take these bookshelves, of course. Hmm. What if? Oh, I don't know what to leave behind. Okay, the salt stones can go. What if? Oh, come on. Oh, boy. All right. <laughs> Got to figure out how to wow. put this down properly. Okay. Um... So, do you know if we have to, like, power the record player? Um, I don't know. Oh, God. Oh, oh, it's starting to get to me. What? Oh, are you going insane? Oh, right I'm now? hearing, I'm hearing sound effects now. Uh-oh. Uh, I still want to dig up this bony soil, so I'm not leaving yet. Okay. I am just too much of a sucker for sifting. I, I cannot leave it. Okay, okay, okay. And now I'm getting the hell out of here. Oh, it's not easy to get back up this. No, it's fine. It's going to be fine. Oh, there are two different ways to go here. Uh, Do you not which know way which way? Leads me... It's going to be fine. Don't worry. Okay. I'm over here building a chicken coop and you're having the fight for your fucking life. Mm. More my temporal stability. Okay, is this where? Okay, okay, so here's the rock tapestry place. Um... Ooh, a brass torch holder. Oh, bring that, bring that, bring it. It'll save us some time. Yeah. Okay. And there are still vessels here that I have to harvest, but I cannot do it now because my inventory is just too full. I have got to come back again to this same ruin. That's pretty cool, though. I will not be gathering any lead in this trip. I've got way too much stuff on me. Okay, yeah, so... Translocator 4, not a bust. Good. Get out of the way, ladies. There's a pig I could murder, even, but I can't do that now. Not now, no. Okay. Oh. I gotta say, this game like meters out progress. Yeah. In a way that it's perfectly slow. <laughs> perfectly slow. Okay. Like so. everything feels like it means something. I'm getting a little 
out of hand over here. Yeah, what's going on? I, I'm, I'm going to try something. I think I might chisel. Chisel. Ooh, uh, chiseling. Chiseling. Okay. I've had plans for a while in that regard. Oh my god, I just fell down a hole. Don't die. It's okay, though. I'm not dead. I just need to dig my way out. Oh boy. Hmm. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. 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 Oh, the holes, Charlie. The holes. Yeah, but you say that to all the girls. <laughs> hmm. Now it's going to be just fine. What if I did this? Ah, there we go. Hmm. Oh, my temporal stability is getting much better. Good. I think the, the ruins themselves were not cursed so much as just, you mean, like, you get temporal stability effects from um, just being deep underground. Mm-hmm. Hmm. So, the same way that, like, different areas have vastly different uh, mineral availability, you know, like, uh -huh. one chunk will have ultra-high sphalerites and another will have none whatsoever. I'm wondering if different regions have different occurrences of other things, like ruins, for example. Maybe. Because, that, that I mean, we found really good stuff in this area in a very short time. That would make a lot of sense. In case folks are wondering... I am doing one of the sort of like killer apps of vintage story here. I'm cheeseling. Oh, I'm cheeseling. oh I, I am very interested in what you're doing. Yeah. Also, I found a gigantic hole. Oh my god. Don't die. Bring home all it's... that good shit. I want to, I want that record yeah. player, god damn it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're very right. You're very right. But I need to mark this because it's it is an enticing hole, Charlie. <laughs> I bet you say that to all the girls. <laughs> I have got to get in there. I bet you say that to all the girls. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing it. Okay. You. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. There's the way home. Hmm. Okay. In the staircase so many times i'm feeling like i want to put pathway stairs on it oh god no more networks of tunnels no no oh absolutely more networks of tunnels. <laughs> Definitely. that's something that i have never regretted i'm freely willing to admit i don't know what i'm doing here folks i'm just kind of messing around i'm very curious Just want it to look nice. Mm. Oop. Definitely not what I need to be wasting my time on, but they have needed a coop for so long. Chiseling the chicken coop, huh? Yes. Interesting. I'm very interested. Oh, I'm just being silly. 
thoroughly unnecessary in every imaginable way. Very curious. I don't know. Oh, I see you're getting fancy. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, no, I see how this is going. I just want it to look like a chicken coop, but okay. I also want it to look nice. Yeah, okay, that's cool. That's cool. I've got so much stuff to put away. Okay. Oh, and you get the tapestry up there. Very nice. And Ooh. ah, dang it. Okay. Now that room in the ore chest. No, we don't. Oh, my God. <laughs> we do not have room for more ore. Okay. okay. It will go in the stones chest because I got nowhere else to put it. This is the uh, copper that I'm putting in there. Okay. And I've got grains and seeds that have got to go downstairs. I've got some rusty gears that have to go in the storage vessel. Most importantly, I've got this echo chamber, mm -hmm. which uh, this will go up in the bedroom. Yeah. Um, up down right near the uh, the storage vessel. Oh, and I've got a crate I've got to do something with. Oh, and I've got bookshelves, too. Those are also going in the uh, storage vessel. Man, dude. And spider webs that I took for some reason. I'm sure they'll be useful. See. Oh, hey, they are ladies. not an ingredient for anything. That's what I like to see. Okay. I know we've kind of got the idea that crates belong in the attic, but uh, the attic is not large enough for all our crates. We are going to need um, to expand the basement. Mm. Yeah. And... What if? Into that. There we go. That looks kind of cute. That looks kind of cute, right, everybody? That's cute. I want to come see. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, so much good stuff. So that's a pretty... <laughs> you have a good time there, Esmeralda? Okay. So. And, yeah. I'm going to go there, ahead and get some glass. We've got flax grain, rice grain, and spelt grain downstairs. Cool. In the storage with all the seeds. And also I have some salt that I think I had mistaken for grain. I'm going to put that 
in the uh, tannery. Stuff goes in the tannery, right? It's more chicken friendly, I think. That's more chicken friendly. Oh boy. Hmm. This has been very productive. Unless. Unless. And that's even more chicken friendly, one might say. Harder to be more chicken friendly than that. Hmm, I wonder. No. There we go. What if I did this? Then, hmm. Ooh, I'm hearing weird noises. Um, I'm sifting. Is that it? That might be it. I just it was just weird and loud. I was like, "What is that?" Hmm. We are amassing quite a collection of rough gemstones. Yes. And we know that we can't really do much with them in the game right now. This no. really makes me hope that we can if migrate to the save game. If you out, I'm going to divorce you. Oh, what are you kidding? No, no, no. We were... Even if we can't cut them, we can sell them. Good. I'm glad we've come to an understanding. It would be foolishness to throw them out. The world's full of foolish people. Yeah, we didn't marry one, though. Nice to be seen. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> Get this and that. I'm spending a disproportionate and unjustifiable amount of time on the chickens, but I'm I'm having so much fun. Hmm. I am interested in what you're doing there. I always kind of feel like cosmetic builds as being the ultimate point of games like this. Yeah. <gasps> oh. Oh? You have fun, girls. I guess they're running from you. They ran into the hen house. <laughs> they don't know what to run from right now. Yeah. That's looking good, though. Thank you. Hmm. I don't know if this is correct. Two, one, two. Okay, no, it's not. Okay, I think what we're going to have to do right now is this. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to have to do. Oh, Barkwell is pointing out, I think, that chickens can climb logs. Is that a possibility? A um, thing? I mean, I believe it. But I'm not done with the hen house right now, and they don't seem to be escaping. Hmm. Yeah, I've, I'm only just now looking at um, the chat at the chat again because I had the uh, prospecting spreadsheet up on my other of monitor course you for did. a very long time. I have not been prospecting for probably a couple hours now. Should get back to 
looking for iron, but at the same time, I've still got ruins to loot. I understand this desire. It's a natural desire. So are you fixing the stuff you intended to fix tonight? Kinda. I mean, I'm making a, uh... You're making a hen house. I'm making a hen house. Oh, Kinda. I'm like, I'm doing stuff I really shouldn't do. There's so much stuff that's so much more pressing, but... Hen house. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, like we're we're comfortable enough that we can take time to do stuff like that now. Yeah. I think we've made it clear that we are no longer in a desperate situation tonight. Okay. I'm going to put a roof on this bad boy. But uh yeah, I'm going to let me just go and uh take care of a few things. Wow, that's that was a long time and I do apologize. Okay. Uh let's see. Now I think I have some glass. I do. I do have some glass. Okay. Let's do it. Okay. I think I that's in here. That. Get these and get that. Ooh, there are drifters <gasps> out there. Fuck! Apocalyptic! Oh no. I'm gonna go attract them. Boy, okay. Um what oh, are you are you player? standing up there? Yeah, we've gotta figure out how to use it. Do you wanna put on some drifter murdering music? Sure, why not? There we go. <laughs> Quirky Tavern it's called! Okay. I am loving this right now. <laughs> Utter disrespect of killing them to this tune. <laughs> Maximum disrespect. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, come on. Wow, it is loud near the player. Yeah. We've won. <laughs> oh, come on! Oh, fucking thing. What is this? I don't have time for this. Come on, get on through. I know you can get in. Oh, you're still alive. That's a mistake. <laughs> what the heck? This is really difficult to get in. So we'll correct this error. Am I error. really going to have to remove this? Oh. Uh oh. Okay. Bitey. <laughs> yes, you got in the quirky tavern. Okay. Okay, dude, you want to do this? Because I'm trying to do something over here. You're ruining it for me. Poultices. Maybe. Oh my lord, that's loud. Oh yes, poultices. Ugly poultices. Okay, who else wants to be fucking ignorant? Oh god, there's so many corpses out here. There sure are. That's what happens. That's what's going to happen. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. There I did we go. Some harvesting. Now, if you are done, you little shits, I'd like to work on my chicken coop. Of course. Why would there be anything wrong? Bronze Falks, baby. This uh this makes some differences. Why would there be anything worth anything on any of you? Trash monsters full of trash. Yep. What a shock, what a shock. Oh. This pulpice. Oh, look at that. I see two of them coming. Coming in hot. I found so many horse tails that I'm undefeatable. That's the situation that oh, they're no, faced no, with no. right now. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. You don't get to just run. They're not, not after fighting that. me. They're fighting my supply of horse tails and cat tails. Yeah. Oh, my fucking God. I could... Sw oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. More horse tails and cat tails. Oh, fuck off with that. You oh, too. maybe it would help oh, to actually bitch. use my shield. That'd be a good idea. I can figure out what button activates it. Okay. Now. There we go. Oh, That's God, so stupid. Hate these things. Now, can I build my chicken coop, please? They are all falling into your rabbit trench. Well, maybe there'll be something worth something on one of them. Mm-hmm. Maybe. Wow. Twine. <laughs> Beyond worthless. You always need more twine. I see one down there. I see you. I got it. Ah. Who is throwing? Somebody's left alive. Ugh. Could not be less interested in your shit right now. Oh, where are you going? I don't think you can just fucking run. You can't fucking run up to me, smack me, and run. There we go. And... Let's get rid of you. Might as well. Okay, cool. Like, so much effort for fucking twine. Just the worst. Okay, so the chickens are alive. That's good. All right, now let's see. Yeah, if we can't drifters never bother them. Fucking do this! I am desperate to do this. God, you just won't let me at all. Down here? No. This way? No, it just won't happen. It's just uh, not gonna happen. Still apocalyptic. Wow, it's just not going to fucking happen. Fine. How about if I get rid of this? If I get rid of this. Okay. Get rid of that. I just, for the life of me, don't get this at all. Okay. What if I do this? Okay. Okay. Wow. Uh, corpses. Yeah, it's just... Holy shit. I think I've killed more drifters in this session than all other sessions combined. I just cannot get this to work, and I'm shocked. I just can't. Just can't. Okay. Let's do other things then. Wow. Crazy. This so is, much twine. So this can, this is so fucking beyond weird. Okay. Oh god, I think they're starting to decay naturally. Huh. The harvest. Okay, well. <sighs> I, I guess this is fine. I mean, it's not what I want. Hmm. 
Hmm. Just weird how that won't work. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, that's a lot of them in there. Yep. Fighting. Killing each other. Cool. I do not want to interrupt them as long as that's going on. I want to go again for a Let's sec. Get out of here. Two fertile eggs, three fertile eggs. Okay. Let's see then. Maybe I can make this look a little better. There we go. This looks something approaching acceptable. Oh, didn't mean to do that. There we go. And Okay, I've got the rabbit trench cleaned out. Nice. Did they drop anything? Uh, still working on the corpses. But I found literally nothing but flax twine yeah, so far. Yeah, it's pretty crappy. Oh. Yep, it's all surface drifters. Nothing good. Now, I think the time has come. We just look at this from uh, the distance and see. If, what do I? How do I feel about it? Oh, that tree's in the fucking way. Well, that's easy to fix. Nobody likes birch. There's a drifter in our damn house. Where is oh, this asshole? Fuck? I think it's in the basements. Oh. There we go. I'm so offended whenever that happens. Uh, rusty gear. Eh. It beats nothing, I suppose. And another one in the basement. We have to get a uh, nice, a nice lantern down there. I think. Idea, yeah. A hey, temporal gear. There we go. Bad. Now, love it, love to see it, love to see all the pumpkins. Okay, the chickens clearly like it in there. And now, let's do a roof. Now. Late. Okay, that's a empty crate. Where'd you say you put the slate? Um, slate's down here. In the little floor basket next to the clay oven. Oh, okay. Now, let's see. Oh no, not not clay. Slate, roof, corner, inner, outer, ridge. Slate. Ooh, look at all this food. Yep. 
Lovely. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, clay. Got it. Let's see. And rift activity is calm. This would be a perfect time to head back out to the ruins. Ooh, but you know, I could do, do a little better. Do a little better. Um, there we go. Where is my... What's, is there something worthy of my axe? Screw it. Need to stop thinking about things in those terms. Okay. Yeah, that's a good point. Oh, dude. Ah, come on. All right. Now. Moving up in the world, folks. Mm hmm. Look at that. Almost, almost made it. Almost made it. Oh. Okay. Oh man. Okay, fine. Thought I could be cool. Guess not. We uh, we do need more clay, don't we? <sighs> Come on, dude. Let me just get up on the roof. Okay. Now. Time for us to stop living with hay roofs. We're better than that now. Ooh, really? You're gonna replace the whole thing with slate? I'm gonna try. Oh. A little bit well, at a time. Well, I know where more slate is if you need it. Pretty cool. That it's is gonna an be exciting like, change. It's gonna be like a real house. Hey, kiddos. Ooh, and then you can use the um, the thatch roofing for like little outbuildings. Mm-hmm. You know, stuff that makes sense to look more rustic. There you go. And let's get these hen boxes out. What's wrong with you? Okay, you're generation two, you're fine. Okay. Oh, uh, I checked out those pear trees on the way. They're still ripening. Yeah, like they got days, days and days and days. Pack dirt, that's what I want. Now. Let's see. Come on. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. It's 17 degrees Celsius, and there's still tiny blocks yeah, of ice ridiculous. in the way. Yeah, it's ridiculous. It's absurd. There's got to be something wrong with the generation, you know? Yeah, go. or like maybe if we spent more time near those blocks, they would recognize the surrounding temperature and melt. Maybe. Yes, it's all coming together. And then, yeah, and then on the other side, yeah. OK. 
Okay. So there we go. Oh, about to starve to death. Have to take care of that. Two, really? Now, how am I about to starve to death? Okay, I could eat more grain. Let's go see. Let's go eat those. Those those loaves of bread I baked so long ago. Oh yeah, the bread. I need those. I'm about to starve. There we go. Yeah, come to think of it, I'm low on grain too. There we go. That ought to fix that. Now, more slate, please. Ooh, it's sunny and windy out here. <laughs> and back on the roof. I apologize for my silence, everyone. I am very focused in this moment. Hmm. There we go. I'm just very pleased oh. that we're moving on from hay roofs, too. This is very there cool. There are a lot of fish Yeah. in uh, this, this river that I'm in, this uh, lake that I'm in right now. Do you want me to bring home a bunch of salmon? Sure, why not? I'll... Let me let me remember to hit this on the way back, cause uh, I may be about to fill up my inventory with um, ruined stuff. And frankly, who knows what other targets of opportunity? But yeah, I think uh, wow, it's it's actually very easy to see them all. So I could probably gather a lot. This is so cool. Oh wow, this is completely changes the character of the house. Wow. I am really eager to see the slate roof. <laughs> there we go. It completely changes the character of the house. And let's see, where's my pack dirt? There it is. So I'm learning new things about, I'm not a professional streamer under any circumstances, obviously, <laughs> but I'm learning a whole lot about myself. Like when I'm concentrating, how quiet I go. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. But you know, it, it feels unfriendly. Hmm. So I keep apologizing for it. Like I know this is supposed to be entertainment for some people. So. But we do also complain about how <laughs> a lot of streamers feel they need to just chatter, fill air. That is true. Yeah, I like. Oh. Okay, and okay. All right, cool. All right, now. Oh, hey, puff balls. Puff? Oh yes, get those. Absolutely, yeah. get those. So maybe we can cook something with mushrooms. That'd be nice. There are actually a lot of them here. Get them. You don't normally actually eat puff balls in reality, though, right? Yeah, you do. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I did not think that was an edible fungus. Hmm. God, I wish I could keep this separate, but I don't think I can. Let me just experiment. I know I can't keep it separate. I know I'm about to break my own heart, but let's just see. What? No. <laughs> nah, didn't think so. Ah, what a shame. Okay. Although... Here, get out of here, you. Gross. Okay. Actually, now, how does one make rough hewn pine fencing again? Rough hewn pine. Okay. Axe, stick, stick, log. And I have those. Okay. And where's my axe? There's my axe. Wow, I've worn through this pretty significantly. And 
That ought to do it. This is going to be the nicest little chicken coop when I finish. <laughs> I'm so proud of it already. Okay. Good. And boop. All right. Now. Okay. Man, the Ooh, chickens haven't copper. gotten a goddamn thing done because I've been here all play session fucking with their house and making them nervous so they can't even mm -hmm. sit on their eggs. But I promise it'll be mm -hmm. worth it, everybody. I promise. Sorry, chickens. It will be worth it. Should I gather more copper or are we now back copper in Copper is always too much important. Copper. Always get always be gathering copper. Okay. I'll do that then. Yeah, I like that. I like that. And we were just talking about this folks about how I think that if the birds or any livestock actually loses contact with the sky, they run a chance of despawning. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to do my best to make sure that doesn't happen. And I'll show you how right now. That is honestly not a terrible chicken coop. Okay. Okay, I need more packed dirt. There we are. Oop. Let's see then. Oh, God, you're going to do this. Um, oh my god. Mm, parsnips. And this is auto. No wonder. God. Okay. Let's try that again. Um, only horizontal. Let's see if they'll pay attention. All right. Cool. Okay. There. I think more cheeseling would resolve the, the height, the entry issue. Although part of me kind of doesn't want to solve it because part of me is like, if I have to squeeze to get in, a bear won't be able to. A wolf <laughs> won't be able to. You know what I mean? Like, there's a reason chicken hen houses have small doors. I'm like, I'm, I'm kind of on the fence about, you know, air quotes fixing it, you know? Hmm. Hmm, how do I feel about All that? Of reasoning. How, do I, how do I feel about that? How do I feel about that? How do I feel about that? It's a little goofy looking, I'll admit, but I don't want them, like I said, I don't want them to lose contact with the sky and possibly despawn as a result. Hello, ladies. Oh boy. Goofy looking. It's a little goofy. I'm gonna looking. use up this pick soon. Little goofy looking. Maybe maybe I will put this here. Oh, I am out on the surface, but there is something fucking up my temporal stability. A little weird. There's no portal nearby. Rift activity is calm. I do not know why I'm getting that effect. Hmm. You know doesn't have to be quite like that, does it? Let's just, let's do a little bit more fixing upping here. It doesn't have to be quite that goofy looking. There we go. Let's take these. Wow, gotta get myself a new chisel soon. I just about destroyed this one. Mm -hmm. Hello, darlings. Almost done, then I'll leave you alone. I heard a noise that I don't think I've heard before. Hmm. Uh oh. 
What's uh oh? Uh, oh, okay. I, I'm not seeing block identity identities when I mouse over blocks. Um, what is the key to turn that on and off? I'm going to do something else. I think. I actually never want to turn that off. I really wish that that there was not a key for it. That should be a settings thing. Okay, one, two, one, two. Okay, sure thing. Where are my sticks? Show high block. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's try that. I wonder. I wonder. Okay, let's just. Because my biggest terror is that some fucking bear is going to bullshit and cheat his way. In. Yeah. So basically, what I have done now is I have double fenced it without making it look like I've double fenced it. Hmm. And while I believe this game is fucking capable of anything, with the only prerequisite being will it break my heart, uh, <laughs> I do believe that this is going to offer a level of security, a relatively safe level of security. Okay. Okay, so you girls stay in there. That's great. That's wonderful. Love that for you. Okay. Is that everyone, by the way? Yeah. That is everyone. Look at you. Huh. Okay. And that'll give me a chance to do a little decorating out here. This can go. This is ugly. I think I've actually done the thing I've been meaning to do for fucking weeks. Like, actual weeks. Yay. How exciting. What are you? Oh. So let's just clean up around here. I don't know what I'm going to do with this hideous fencing. Probably I'm going to use it to catch myself some sheep, like I keep talking about wanting to do. Yeah, really sheep would be a good thing to get done tonight. Five days, two days, okay. Get started on tonight, more to the point. Mm -hmm. Okay. And... God, I can't believe I actually built a hen house that I'm, like, halfway satisfied with. Hey, I found a tattered linen shirt. In <laughs> terrible condition. Lucky! Ooh, and 21 uh, units of lime. Oh. Well, well I won't nice turn that down. Okay. I really don't give a fuck about it. These three hand baskets. Well, you can cut them up into. Of course, reeds. don't. Oh, oh! How can I do that? Uh, uh, you just put them in your crafting grid with a knife. Thank you. That's excellent. Because mm -hmm. reeds are always handy. Oh God! Look, it, it looks halfway fucking civilized now. Everybody, look at it. Oh, that's such a huge improvement. Okay, such a huge improvement. Such a huge improvement. Okay, now. Ooh, a thonic planter. Gate. Okay. Wood, wood, stick, stick. Do I have any? Yes, I do. Great. And sticks. All right. And we'll put that there. Oh, look, it's like a real hen house. It's like real. 
I love it. No. Where are the other? There they are. Oh, crap okay. loads more reeds and blue clay, which I was just looking for at home a little while ago. Nice. I suppose these aged wooden beds are good. Let's you sleep for up to 9.5 hours. Is oh, that better than what we have? That's that way like better than we time. have. Get those. Oh, there are two. Great. Dang it. Okay, and with that, my inventory is filled. This is actually looking halfway decent now. But I'm starving! Let me go home and get something to eat before I finish this off. I'm so happy with it, though. I know we have some cabbage. Yep. There we go. There we go. Now. I do have some... Okay, cool. I do have some crap fence left. The crap fence will be commandeered. And... Okay. Yeah, this is pretty good. This cave where I found these ruins that I've been looting, it seems to be part of a whole cave complex. Oh. And I'm just wondering if these other paths lead to other ruins. I don't think so, so far. I think it's just the two. No. Still, two ruins in one cave complex is pretty rad. Yep. I'm going to go very quickly. I am not going down that waterfall. No. Ooh. Okay. Now more pine, fortunately. Sounds good. Oh, no, that's an axe. Oops. What we want is that. There we go. Now... And there we go. Let's try that. Okay, okay. I'm to head home. Okay, I think I'm going to be satisfied with this. I think this is going to work for me. The real question right now is, where is my axe? There we go. And... Hey, Goyles. How are you? Uh-oh, can I just not pick that up? Guess not. Tell you what. I will put down that. And I will uh. take this, put it here, put that here, put this here. There you go. And while I'm in here, a little something. There we go. Please tell me you're not stuck. I'm going to go ahead and assume since you're stupid, you're stuck. I mean, you could just be running for me. I literally don't know, though. Okay, I know for a fact you can get out of there, so. Anybody want to come out here and sit on these? Hmm. Okay, let's see what they, oh. They're calm now. 
I love it. Yeah. I think that's Chicken's a hen house, calm. folks. I think that's a hen house. Nice. Now, with that off my plate, let's see what's happening in here. Craziness, no doubt. Yeah, growing, growing, growing. Oh, lots of mature carrots. Holy crap, look at all those mature carrots. Any pea crop then? Oh wow! Ooh, gotta put some stuff away. Have you decided to live or die yet? You haven't. Okay. The uh, the fruit trees are still in limbo. Um, a couple of them are. Not all. Now. Let's put you away. You shouldn't be here. Come here. Oh, there's some really interesting caves around here. Oh, yeah? Oh, no, no, this one is not interesting after all. It's easy to get into, but then it's very shallow. Um, oh, is it in here you need to go? Oh, but on the other side. Oh, that's a little frightening. No, 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 no. Do not have time for this. I gotta say, I like the translocator four area. There's a lot going on. Here. Really? No, yeah, just I mean, it's a staggering amount of ruins, lots of caves. Okay. Yeah, we found some good stuff here. Throw that back there. It's been shockingly little hassle. Yeah. I saw a bear once. You Ugh. know, other than that. Really no troublesome wildlife. Um, oh, and here's a massive amount of blue clay, which I would gather if I had any inventory space or a shovel. <laughs> Let's see. There. You know what? Put that there, too. And let's go get those carrots. What are we growing down there now? Maybe parsnips? Let's grow some parsnips. It's been a while. Oh, speaking of parsnips. Oh, you're not done yet. Okay. And you're still growing. And you're mature. Nice. Okay. That's working out. How many carrots did I get from that? 53, not bad. Let's get these in the root cellar. There we go. Okay. And there we are. Okay. Now that's taken care of. I'm going to go look at my. I think I won't be able to see my hens anymore from my. Oh, I just realized. Oh, well, I can kind of see them. They're in there. Mm. They kind of like being in there from the look of things. That's interesting. Which one? Suppose they're you... hiding. Maybe. I wish one of these fucking dolts would, like, sit on those eggs out there. Oh, well, that's not ideal. Yeah, I know they, I know they can come out and do that. Kind of important. But I love that they're, like, in there and they, like, seem to be enjoying it and stuff. I love that a lot, actually. Hmm. I like the little hen house. It's not perfect, but it is a genuine effort on Aww. my part. 
I'm glad that you like your hen house. Yeah, it looks like a hen house, you know? Hmm. And it's kind of, it's pretty safe. I think it's pretty safe. I like sure it. I'm just like admiring it now. Plan. I like it a lot. Okay. Glad I made that other saw blade too. Oh, oh wow. What's that? Look at that. Ooh, lots Damn. of salmon. Three saw blades. Gracious. Okay. I should go check on the bees. It, um, is salmon something that should be provided in multiples of a certain number? Like you need two to make a fish meal or something like that? Um, all meats should be provided in fours. Ah, uh, okay. Then I want three more. Okay, let's go get some blue clay, because I think I left a hole in the ceiling over here. Yes, I did. So let's take care of that before something incredibly obnoxious happens. It is perhaps not ideal the best way to gather fish meat is by jumping in the lake and hitting them with a fox. <laughs> it's maybe not... I don't think I should be chasing down the salmon. <laughs> that Spear doesn't seem work. like the level of realism that this game aspires to. Now, where is... There you are. Okay, let's just get you taken care of over here. All right. And you. I need to get one more fish. <laughs> and I need to make a knife. Sure. Why not? Then I will come home. I believe you. There we go. 32. Well, let's let's make a little bit more. I don't think either of us has died this whole session. No, I don't think we have. I came a little close. I got a little sassy with a few of those uh, drifters, but no, they didn't get me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. In the midst of an apocalyptic rift storm, you know, we got a little injured, but we've really been okay. Yeah. And you know what that means? That means, that means a celebration is in order. <laughs> celebration. Oh, yeah. Let's try... To celebrate with quirky tavern music? No, through the grass at night. Mm -hmm. huh. Who wants to be salmon number eight? Through the grass at night is not playing, so let's see what else there is. Cultured oh. tavern? Let's try cultured tavern. There we go. Welcome to my cultured tavern. Uh, I wish I could hear it. Da, 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 da. Okay. I wonder if it'll get quieter when I patch this hole in the roof. Uh. Nope. Okay. Ah, there we go. There's the last fish. Okay, okay, that's enough of that. Coming home.
No, wait, you know what? Before I cut you down, give me all your fucking, like, leaves and sticks and stuff. The only thing birches are good for. Give me your sticks. There we go. Uh. Now you can go away forever. Gross birch. You know what? I'm not thrilled about this oak either, if I'm being completely honest with myself. Go away, oak. I don't even know who invited you. Get out of my culture cavern. Wow, this is really tearing through this axe. I don't hear the music. Oh, really? Where are you? The house. Oh, wow. That's weird. It's real loud on my stream. Yeah, yeah, I believe it. Okay, um, I've got lots of stuff to put away here. There we go. Get that shit out of my front yard. Okay, now. Where's that pack of dirt? Is this like even correct? Because it doesn't feel correct. Look at that. Oh yeah, there are all kinds of blocks falling down here. Okay, I think that's right. Okay, I am going to pop both of these beds. Okay, um, go for it. I'm excited to see what our ancient beds look like. Oh, they don't look great, honestly. <laughs> well, they're, ancient. they're more functional. How about that? You can put the the um, oh, block is not really... oh, okay. There we go. Yeah, they um, they do they do look their age. Uh huh. But uh, we can we can take the the, the other. The beds that you actually made will not go to waste. We can definitely put those someplace. Okay. We can put them at the uh, one of the trans trans locators. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Over here. There we go. And more. And see, I'm, I'm taking this hay roof off because mm -hmm. after the chickens, I have to figure out how I'm housing the pigs because the pigs deserve to be safe, too. 
I'm uh, picking up all the blocks you're dropping. That's fine. Thank you. Yeah, we can uh, we can use those too. Like that's uh, yeah. Those would be good for things like uh, barns. Oh, we have like a fucking house, dude. Oh, it's so cool. Like we actually have a fucking house. Seeds, grain, and mushrooms to put down here. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, and of course, also, um, I've got that. Uh, oh, it's like a real house. There we go. <laughs> the diegeticness of it. I love this music so much. Yeah, me too. Oh my god, look at this. Oh, look. Look, we made a fucking house. Like, get the fuck out of town. We did it. We have a house. Like, this house is, like, not great. It's not great. I'm not going to sit here and bullshit you about that. But we could... Oh, I'm, like, already imagining how I'm going to fix it now that, you know, I've kind of found my feet with the chisel. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to pop over here. Take a look at the chickens. Okay, they are they are in there. They're in there. Um, we've got some raw some raw bush meat that's like twenty three percent spoiled. Oh really? Where do you want to like keep that on you and let it rot or do you want to cook it? Uh where is it is it do you have it right now? It's right here. Okay, throw it's it on right me. on the floor. Uh okay, give me some, uh... Wow, yeah. Okay, I will cook that right now. I will give you those uh, roof blocks as well. I've got some lime. Hey, you have uh, that brass, that tomorrow. brass, uh, torch. Yeah, I put that up, actually. Um, that's upstairs, I think. Um, I would like to put it down here. Okay, let me go back it. Oh, look at all that up there. <laughs> look at all these pieces of roof that have fallen in. Thank you. Now, because you know what the special thing about this is? Do you know? Um, it holds a torch, and the torch does not go out while it's in it. Yeah, the torch never goes out. That is cool. So what that means is, let's go ahead, put you here, put you here, put you here. And where are you, brass candle? There you are. All right, put you here, put you here. So now, when it's time to light the fire, there will always be a torch at the ready. Big idea. You okay. can't light a fire with an oil lamp. Yes, and I'm actually going to go ahead and stick these in here now. Now, what else do I have that can go in there? Oh, an acorn. That's nice. 22 liters of rot. Um, blah, blah, blah. Anything else? Okay. All right, that's looking pretty good. Yeah, there we go. Already improvements, improvements all around. Okay, well, it is 11 p.m. Oh, my um, gosh. Probably a good time for us to log. Oh, did you see the uh, the planter? The planter? Oh, no, not you yet. You actually plant stuff in these. I'm, I presume you can. I am Grab just grabbing bit. two brand new freaking pumpkins to take in. Yeah, look, look, look. <gasps> I love it. So... Yeah, think about where you want that to go and what you want to put in it. Doesn't I will. Have to be oh my gosh. I'm sorry this is such a sedate little stream, everyone. Gosh. We, well, we got a lot done. We got a this ton done, a really... but we didn't die. There was no, like, embarrassment. We didn't, we didn't die, but we, we killed loads of drifters. Oh my god! I know the perfect way to cap off this wonderful stream. Oh yeah? Wine's done. Everybody? Shit, yeah, okay, gimme. Give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> Hold on. I have to go to uh, settings because I want to just look at controls because I know there is a control where you can actually, like, see me. Third person camera. Okay, is it plus or minus? Let's see what that does. No? Plus? Minus? Has it's it over forgotten. here? Plus? Minus? No, that's not it. Hold on. There's got to be a button I can press so you can see me in third person. First, third person, oh, F5. Okay, let's see. 
Oh, there I am. There I am, everyone. Hi, this is what I look like, I guess, when I'm playing this game. <laughs> and there's Matt. And guess what it's time for? It's time to get fucking drunk. It's time to get drunk, everybody. We have over 100 liters of cranberry wine here. And we even have some blackcurrant wine. Look how long it's good for. For days and days and days. 51 days for the We only have the one jug, don't we? Yeah, we only have the one jug. But I can share it with you. Check this out, everybody. Yeah. This will be fun. So that's 50 liters of cranberry wine. Okay. Oh, can I not? Ooh. Can I? How does one pick it up? Huh. Yeah, what combination of shift and control and right yeah. click or left click? Is does there it something take? in here? No, there's not anything in here. Oh, mm. there is three liters of water in here. No wonder. Oh. Uh, God. How do you empty it? I'll go and empty it up here. Get on to Vino, baby. I I intend to. There we go. Now. Empty. There. That's the stuff. Okay. Now, let's get let's get in here. Let's let's do it. Let's have some fruit satiety, everyone. Uh, the black currant wine. I think yes, fifty liters of black currant wine. That's that's yeah, okay, so. Alright. We now have three liters of black currant wine in my jug. And Okay. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Drink it up. A little more. Oh, oh. Do you see it? <laughs> a little more? Not bad. Not bad. Let's get a little more. Uh, no, no, no. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Hold on. I hungry. need to. I need to. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, well, let me just uh, get out of the way here. Uh, uh, okay. So is that what I want? No. What? Did I put it away? I did put it away. No. Get that back. Damn it. This is hard. What are you even? I am trying to, to get the fucking jug back. There we go. Forty-four. Okay. Now, let's see. Can I? Can I drink? Okay. That's one more. So now everything is starting to sway a little bit. A little bit more. Oh. Oh. Yeah. You see stuff's moving. You. Also, you are swaying. You are visibly swaying back and forth just a little. There's the jug. Oh, okay. I am visibly swaying back and forth, eh? Look, that's good for my fruit satiety, everyone. I'm just looking out for my nutrition. <laughs> now, are you sure you're drinking the wine and not the juice? I am drinking the juice. Yes, you have to drink the wine. I do like the juice, though. <laughs> um, okay, here's the wine. <laughs> I think, am I? Oh, okay, yeah, it's swaying. <laughs> we are now drunken. It's swaying and undulating. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can't even look in a straight direction. Am, yeah. I, am I visibly swaying back and forth? You are kind of like reeling I am, slightly. I am not touching the mouse in my Me view. Me neither. I'm not touching anything. We're just kind of. And this, by the way, is not the drunkest we can get, And everyone. Just so you know, this is not the drunkest we can get. Oh, that's the drunkest we should probably get for now. Yes, that's definitely oh, the drunkest goodness. we should get for now. Um, but during the winter, when there is like nothing else to eat. <laughs> yes. There's we'll going to be a lot of drunkenness, I think. And close it out, okay. putting this meat on so it doesn't spoil, because we're going to forget about it. That was not the most productive time, everyone, I, but we did get a oh, few we, things We done. got a lot done. Are you we kidding? turned on Translocator 4. I finally, finally, finally built the hen house. Oh, and look, we've we got, got marble, we got saltpeter, we got loads and mm. loads of relics and stuff, including a record player. We got a tapestry, we got another book, mm -hmm. we got new beds we oh, have man. We a lot more pumpkins i didn't even see the new beds i'm gonna go upstairs and look at the new beds yeah, look at the new beds they're kind of go bad. upstairs and look at the new beds 
not Let's as see pretty them. as the beds that you made. Oh, they're ancient beds, but look at this. We can sleep for 9.5 hours. That's amazing. And, and we got right a record now, player. We, oh, God, I forgot sure. about that. We got a record player, everyone. Also, I don't know if you saw down in the, um, the tannery, mm -hmm. we've got a couple aged wooden chairs. Oh, how nice. Really look more like Ottomans, frankly. They are aged, aren't they? Let's see. Can I sit on them? I'm sure there's a button to sit, but... I have a feeling that you need a mod for that. Oh, hey. I think sitting is probably not... We'll take these prepared yeah. hides, and you know what? We'll stick them in here, and check that shit out. 25 leather in 4.5 days. 25 Very nice. leather. So, seal does that? that mean that it's time for armor soon? I think primarily Cause... our first move is going to be getting you a couple more backpacks. But then after I that, need a armor. More backpacks. True. And look at that. Armor we made is... a ton of bronze. We made bronze weapons. We made a, a bronze a bronze saw. We made a couple more bronze pickaxes. We're actually just carrying made a around bow, bronze which stuff which has now. been massively effective. Yes, and it's just now things are really picking up, and we are on our way to doing armor. That's that's a big thing. Yeah, we are armor on our way. armor is great. Armor might even take precedence over backpacks because mm -hmm. it stays with you when you die. I will not like, that we've been dying a lot lately. Not we that have, we've been. We, uh, yeah, we have, that this is, is our first session when neither of us has died at yeah, all. That is incredibly important to note. We are not dying. We even have a planter. We're getting kind of. We're caring about looks suddenly. We're we're chiseling. Uh, yeah, we got to do more chiseling. Yeah, chiseling, chiseling. I'm gonna do one last thing before we go though. I'm gonna look at this. Okay, so the pear tree died. <laughs> So the oh, one well. bad thing happened. One bad thing happened. <laughs> it has clearly snapped me back to sobriety. The pear tree is dead. <laughs> so that didn't okay. work out. The one thing that didn't work out. Well, let's go look at the apple trees and see how they look. Yeah, Are the apple yeah, trees yeah. dying? No, the apple trees haven't decided to live or die yet. So, but God, look at them. Look at the size of them. A lot of them are going just fine. Yeah. We have an actual fucking orchard. That's amazing. But okay. Uh, let's go ahead and end it here. Everyone. Yeah, thank you indeed. so let's... much for coming. I super appreciate it. Thank you for like looking yeah, at everyone, our thanks so much. dumb little game. Thank you for like beholding the travesty that is our attempts to play. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna save and leave. Good night, everybody. Yeah. Uh oh, what'd you just do? Come on, save and leave. Don't mess up. Don't mess uh, up. I if you mess that. up, my heart will be broken. Okay. All right. <laughs> yeah. So that was great, per usual. Thank you for your tolerance and patience while I sat silent chiseling a chicken coop. Y'all are the best. Like, subscribe, back wine ghost on backer kit, all that jazz. Follow me on Blue Sky. Follow me on Twitter. All that.